ruin anything. You ruined it all. <laughs> it was me the whole time. Turns out I was the bad guy. Is this right? Dengar K4 expertise guidance chips punishing one. Oh, turn off that sound. There we go. It's 52 points? I thought you got more in Dengar Asajj than this. Oh, did this they, seems did they really turn fair. On audio over there? Yeah, they have audio for it, just like table audio. I was just going to have it running in the background so we can hear if anything crazy happens. All right, cool. You you take care of that because then because anything I hear is going to go through. This yeah, screen. everybody's going to hear. There hasn't been anything audible for the other stuff, so I imagine you're in the clear. Sweet. Man, this is a legal post-fact list on the left. He's practicing. Don't, He's getting ready. He's like, hey. Don't tell anybody. Why does this Dango... Like, he has a six-point bid, though? That seems unlikely. I'm going to assume there are Torps involved because it makes a lot of sense. Oh, he probably can't make it in the squad builder because all that stuff doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I solved the mystery. That's probably true. So then if this is 100 points, it is... Let's see. Yeah, he's got six points, so Plasma Torps EM unhinged. Yep, that would be 100 points. That makes much more sense. This seems really fair. Oh, because it's only 90-something points. Yep. Oop, I did get us Andrew Bunn. Is he good enough to, to be on with us? Sure. All right. Let me... Put him in the call. Yeah, I don't know. Skype. One sec. I'll figure it out. All right, people at home. So thank you for joining us. Um, I'm going to be invading their Twitch chat and say, hey, come, come, come over here. And we have commentary. Nobody say anything about good commentary, but commentary. Okay. Yep, he just said right here, sorry, the list builder we used to generate this thing has been updated. <laughs> there it is. All there right, it. to fix it. That looks like a much better list than yeah. what he had up before. Yep. Uh, people watching, I'm going to be adjusting the screen real quick. I just need to pull out a couple windows. I know it looks funky right now. More commentary for these games. Open Gold Squad Gold Squadron Podcast on Twitch in the background live now. It's happening. So this is round three. This is round um, three. They just they just hooked it up. They're starting to move some ships here. I just posted the uh, tabletop thing. Like it has all the pairings and uh, current player standings in your chat. So Travis Foss is two MOV above Jaron Foss, and we're not letting him live it down at the moment. <laughs> two two. Alrighty, how do I get this pop out chat? Give me the pop out chat. Oh, God, I thought you had your stream key on for a second. I was like, oh, no. Panic. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fine. We're safe. Everything's fine. Okay. Yep. Uh, okay. And these are R5. Is R5 Astromech the discarded damage card one? Or not discard, flip down? Uh, I should really know that off the top of my head. R5 Astromech. Do not know, sir. During the end phase, you can choose one of your face down damage, face up damage cards with a ship trait. And flip it face down. Okay. Almost all of them are ship crits, so it's actually not bad. And you don't really need R2 Astromech because your two turns are already white, and you don't care about stress. Okay. We're sponsored by Bud Light. We're uh. sponsored by Bud Light. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> strong. All right. So that should be full screen for you guys now. So in order to uh, commentate on a stream that's happening on another thing, it's, it's a lot of windows. So 
we used to do this all the time for uh, Korea time for StarCraft because they'd have their streams going at like 3 and 4 in the morning and nobody spoke English for like right. those at the tournaments. So you okay. just restream it with the English people speaking over it. Yep. Okay. Cool. So hopefully it looks good. Uh, I got it open. Yeah, it looks fine. Sweet. Great, even. There we go. All oh, beautiful. We even got we got our little uh, characters there watching in the background. It's beautiful. <laughs> They're not little. Palpatine's a big guy. He is a big guy. He's got lightning and everything. Out of range. Sorry, Dengar. Not for you, sir. But what if he really wants it? He can't. There's no... I mean... God, that... So, I don't know if you've seen the Wookiees in action, because they've been all over Vassal and, like, have recently sprouted up locally. But, oh my god, they don't die. They're, like, immune to damage. <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous. Like, I'm looking at this this Dengar Expertise Alpha, like, trade that's going to happen on one of these guys, and it's like, I don't I don't think it's enough to kill one. Like, Plasma Torp Primary Expertise, like, alright, whatever, seven hits. I mean, t I'm going to need more than that, Dengar. It's only five damage yep. at most. And then he's going to have four ships shooting him back, so... Yeah. And Dengar, not a fan of TLT, as it turns out. He is not. So, probably, what, Dengar probably shouldn't be turning into four ships? Well, I would agree, but he kind of didn't give himself an out. <laughs> yeah. So... <laughs> and Asajj has to move first here, so I don't understand. So, Asajj... Asajj's greens are like all the three speeds and then the two straight and the four straight and all of those seem bad. I guess the like, we can't see if it clears from here, but like the four straight, turn the arc right, push focus, whatever isn't bad. Ooh, the Wookiees aren't even going to pretend they're not a turret. I like it. Hmm. So he does the, it looks like the front reinforce. Yep. Uh, because if you're in any part of the front arc, then the front reinforce arc is better. So if you're not really sure, like somebody could land right on the border, the front arc one is much better. Oh, it's huge. It is it's absolutely so big. Huge. Yeah. At first I, I went and made an ass out of myself and assumed that like, Oh, it, uh, like if you're more on one side I'm like, Oh, then I read it. I was like, Oh, okay. <laughs> just, oh, the front's just way better. Yeah. Okay. I'm in. <laughs> But I'm in the back. It doesn't matter. You nick the other side. All right. Clears it like a champ. Clear stress. Bottle cap. Turning that for his first action. There it is. Oh, your stream's ahead of mine. Let me refresh. There we go. Like magic, Asajj is pointing the right direction. Oh, oh. I like it. Wow. Called so hard, though. Yeah, Those Wookiees sure. turning in, into the rocks. The hard one would have been significantly safer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, so. I'll getting wrecked by autofocus. Well, so it's kind of interesting because it's like the hard one would be safer, but usually your opponent doesn't turn into the rocks here, so your four straight looks super brilliant. And he's also only down a damage, and his next turns are now much better. Right, I don't so know. He's got to roll for it. We can't see I that guess. dice, so something happened, maybe. Yeah, stuff happened. They've got a really good dice overlay, but I think it just happened to get rolled just barely off it. Yeah. But they're also really good about updating the health and hull and everything, so we probably don't have much to worry about. Sweet. So it looks like he's safe. Yep. Over there. And then he only loses one action on it, like whatever. He's still got target lock focus. It's fine. Just roll natties. Easy. <laughs> I was really surprised you were up this late, but uh, then I remembered you're also in fake time. Yes. Alright. Alright, so it looks like Dengar Did he get any damage in there? Doesn't look like it. I'm still trying to get Andrew into the Skype call, so I missed any dice that were rolled. Uh, they weren't Oh, but, there they are. There's a blank. Come on, Dengar, you can do better than that. We're re rolling that one. I guess it was cocked. Picking things up. Natty. Oh what a god. Plus the reinforced. So it feels real bad to have a a, a Wookiee ship pull three evades on you. Pretty for, sad. Feels bad, man. For sure. So that gets evaded too because of the reinforce. Alrighty. 
picking up some tokens, and it looks like we're back at it. I mean, so Asajj has the has the room to be able to come around the backside, um, but I mean, De yeah. Dengar. Mm, he's Skype is claiming that my microphone is very quiet. Is that accurate or is it fine? Uh, Skype is a dirty liar. You sound great to me. Oh, thank you. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Andrew is in the call now. He's just silent. Can you guys hear me? Yeah. Yo. Hey, how's it going? Oh, you're on West Coast time, so this is like a super reasonable hour for you. Yeah, I like just got home. That's like really fake time. <laughs> oh, it's the only real time. What are you guys talking about? <laughs> like I'm going to bed and you're like just got out of work. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> you got Actually, the stream open? Chris, Chris stays up really late, so it works out. No, I'm a responsible adult that does responsible adult things. Did you is that true? No. Not even a little true. Does Asajj... Hey, Mr. Paratani player, does Asajj clear that two-turn without hitting that rock? Uh, I can't tell from angles and stuff. It's really bad on the stream. Um, it looks super tight. <laughs> I guess if it doesn't work, like, whatever. Yeah, it, she, she won't be in a horrible spot, but I think that's the move. Because okay, I think if, you take Asajj, if it overlaps the rock, then it's going to... I mean, because it might... And before the rock? No, never mind. I think it hits the rock. The thing is, like, Asajj does not have time to go around. Like, even if she wants to go around the long way? Yeah, I mean, nobody's shooting her next turn, so whatever, right? Like, just eat it. It's fine. It's not fine, but it's better than the alternative. Right, yeah. Going around the long... 11 turns, baby. Only 11. <laughs> and this is already uh, 3 or Whoa, 4. Whoa, the Wookiees! They don't care about rocks! They got places <laughs> to be! Asajj, but I really don't get this positioning from Degar Asajj here. Uh, he had to, he K turned Asajj early. Like the Andrew Winan started on the left. This is like turn three. So Asajj went fast straight out and then did the five K and then turned like came back around. And Dangar got caught where he was gonna have to one turn into the entire list or like fly over a rock and run away. And both were bad options. I see. But these Wookiees are really excited to fly into rock, so that might save him. Yeah, I think you definitely eat the rock, even if it's a risk with the Sage. Cause... Oh, hold on. I got to. Sorry, people. I have to adjust something. I didn't even uh -oh. think about that. It's all over. Yep. Oh, the border? Yeah. Or, yeah. Oops. Not bad. <laughs> One sec. Somebody said BS, Chris. You got to call me on what I'm BSing. You can't just say BS, Chris, on everything. I mean, you can. I can't stop you. You do whatever you want. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, just gonna take the three onto the rock. Yep. Maybe he's stressed. It looks like the two is easy, like super on it as well, though. So, if that's where the three lands, then whatever. Sorry. People oh no. Home. Give him. Give me one second. Don't give him the second. Burn Twitch chat down. Riot. Riot. Probably best to take her. It's probably best for Dengar to just hit that Wookiee. Although, I don't know if he predicted that. Yeah, I don't like the sloop or the hit the Wookiee are like the only things he's got. Looks like he wants the target lock, though. I need three screens. I don't have three screens. You do need three. Every, everyone in your chat needs three screens. If you don't have three screens, you're doing it wrong. And everyone I know that has three screens is like, why don't I have four? This is like worst case scenario. I guess you can maybe barrel roll away from the TLTs. Yeah. If there's room, uh, it's worth edges. He's only getting out of one, so it's, it might not even be worth it. Yeah, feels bad, man. Feels bad, man. And Dengar is worth more than two Wookiees, so, uh, or any like, combo of two ships, which feels really bad. So Asajj has got to kill three if Dengar just goes down like a sack of bricks, which he's going to. I would love this matchup normally, like... I just feel like the engagement is as bad as it could possibly be for Dengar Asash here. Well, Adam, yeah. Adam called it. He he absolutely called it. He figured Dengar wasn't going to turn in, and he ends up engaging him in the rocks and has advantage there. Three hits coming from Dengar. Evade plus okay. reinforce, I'm assuming. Where did it all go so wrong? 
No, that guy went over a rock, so he's got no reinforce. Oh, okay, he's gonna be taken too. Yeah. So he's got one third points on that Kashyyyk defender. That's good. <laughs> because that counts that way. It does. One hit from uh, from the middle Wookiee. Yep. D Dengar should. It's, it's three or three obstructed, so it's negligible. He's yeah. Fine. <laughs> Rolls a bucket of dice. That shot would have hit if that were Vader. Pro tip. <laughs> The Wookiees are whiffing, it sounds like. And then that TLT is out of the range after the barrel roll, right? Yeah, like the it. barrel rolls are not to be really good. That probably saved him. Yeah. And so now, now Asajj is behind in a pretty strong position. Yeah. So now if you're that front Wookiee, are you uh, going to stay in the fight for another couple turns? Or are you going to bail to start preserving MOV? Uh, you don't need to bail yet, I don't think. I, Dengar can't get Torps off. Well... He could sloop, but I don't think he would do that. I think he just is a hard one. Yeah, he's got the target lock already, so the sloop's a little better because of that. But Yeah, you could go this for the sloop if you just want to kill that Wookiee with Torps. But I, did, I think I'd rather face most of them and get more gun shots, maybe. But maybe, maybe the sloop isn't that bad. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not. It's hard to see where that angle's going to end up, like the sloop barrel roll. But it looks yeah, I good. Don't, I don't like the angle because I think it's like... like I don't know. If the Wookiee, the Wookiee probably hard twos here. And you should yeah, the have two or three arc. seems best, right? And then that other Wookiee's just sad that there's a rock in front of him, but we all know Dengar's not shooting him, so it doesn't actually matter. All right, With I'm Asajj, back. I want to go like three or four straight. I'm back. Welcome back. Hey. We had a revolution while you were gone. We're in charge now. Nope. That's fair. What if Dengar is a hard click two. Away. <laughs> I can kick you from the Skype call. That's fine. If but Dengar is a hard can two, you can still hear dodge. me. <laughs> but I won. That's what counts. <laughs> All right. Nope. Okay, so he just sets up the uh, Wookiees to keep getting shot. So the sloop with Dengar might not actually be bad. Because it'll suck this turn, but next turn he can just run into everything or uh, just get past the Wookiees. Uh, uh, man, I need to get gl like better glasses. I can't see anything here. <laughs> like this chat is so so tiny. There's and there's no way to zoom it in. Oh yeah, let me pull out the chat so I can yell at them for being wrong or whatever. So Def Kano, is that a sarcastic thanks Gold Squadron or actual thanks Gold Squadron? That's the question. I don't know what's going on. There's there's never an unironic thanks Gold Squadron. Oh, Sorry, okay. just checking. So we're on turn oh. we're on turn five. Asajj is like, oh my god, I need to help. I need to get in there. I need to get some shots. Should be able to shoot. I guess one of these he has wings. straight. If the straight yeah. clears that rock, then that's pretty good. <laughs> it's even like the oh, it's push Asajj. It's got to be a two straight, but it still looks good. Yeah, he should be fine. Yeah, that worked a lot better than I thought it would. The good thing is a break gives you time to sober up. Why would you want to sober up? That's not American Nationals. It's always a good time. Says the guy who doesn't drink. I'm drinking right now. Yeah. You're... Purified drinking water. Same here, sir. We are super sober together. I can't. Oh, my God. If you drank, you'd be terrible. I. Indeed. <laughs> I'm already Apparently terrible. Awesome. But he doesn't need to drink. He's always really bubbly anyways. Drunk on power. No, extroverted Chris, you get like two hours of a week, and it's back into the shell. Uh, let me know, people at home, if this is better. I turned up my audio a bit. Audio. So he does do the slew. So he should get that tarp shot off, which is the only reason to do that. Yeah, um, the one bad that. thing is now his greens are going off the table, except for <laughs> his threes. So yeah. that's one issue with Dengar if you sleep like that well we did see in the last game the three bank off the table was very strong oh, are you serious uh, I, his I, best I move. that was the first round game, right yeah yeah sorry <laughs> the, the first game we saw the three bank off the table it was very there's what judge Barrel so roll. he just 
decline torque shots to maybe get out of arc. Is that on the board? It is. Yeah, okay, the, so the, the board goes on is, further than we yeah. can see. They couldn't get the camera high enough. Gotcha. That's a very understandable problem. Yep. I guess Australians are tall, so the tables are high. Yep. I mean, he better have gotten out of two shots for that to be worth it. Yeah, I mean, he, he's out of both TLTs now. He And the back Wookiee, but now he's he's shooting at the not-reinforced Wookiee, so I guess it's fine. Yeah, that's, that's a good move, then. It's so hard to tell the distances on here. Yeah, but now Asajj is just going to eat all those TLTs. Well, I mean, True. yeah. And Asajj doesn't like TLTs. Like, she's really good against primary shots. God, this dice tray thing is so cool. I wish the players would roll into it. <laughs> well, it looks it looks like from the from the look of it that he also couldn't get the dice tray high enough. Yeah, high like enough. The, the camera high enough. Hey, there we go. They're listening. Three hits. Thanks, guys. And one of eight. So takes uh, takes one. It's, uh, there's no reinforce, so it should be two on that guy. Right over there. Takes more. I don't know. Takes more. He takes some amount of damage. Yep. Yeah, Sash, get him. There's no tractor. There's no title here, um, because you can load all the points you want on Dengar for now. <laughs> yeah, she, she's just gonna get some goodies in a few weeks. Yep. No, I think you just do counter measures, clear stem Dengar. That's also fair. You have about the same amount of points for Sash, right. like maybe two. More. So Asajj Asajj doing get, some work. Yep, getting two damage in on one of the Y wings. Get it, girl. Get it. Um, Asajj's arc is pointed to the right currently. Twitch chat person. There's a little bottle yeah. cap on top. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, and it has an arrow on it. It's really handy for the stream. It is very cool. Yep, so. It's really handy in general. Like The, the model for the Shadowcaster like, entirely covers the uh, base. So you can't really... Oh, daddies. There you go. But she, I think she still took it. Not quite enough. All right, Dion. I'm sorry. I don't mean to start a party on you. I got you one more, but you'll want him. That's, I promise. That's fine. I this is with especially with like Twitch, Twitch. This more people the better. It's fine. Bring them on in. Just open up the it, door. We got we're matched Twitch chat very well. We got uh, Jeremy Chambly, Ooh. our own personal Twitch chat. Is, is he gonna sound like a robot? Our Coruscant champion. I don't think so. Yeah, our, our system open champion. My system open champion. He's, he's my system open champion too. He's gonna be the you're, he's gonna be the Coruscant champion for two years. Two. No, there's a Coruscant this year. Yeah, he's gonna win it again though. That's right. Easy. Oh, I see. I see. He Seems won it like last year I mean, too. He's gotta beat sixty four players this time under a pseudonym. Got it. All right, I think he has absolutely no idea what's going on. I said, hey, are you free in an hour, an hour ago <laughs> for commentary? And he said, maybe, question mark? Just and then it. he said, okay, what's up? So whatever, it'll be great. No no problem, fate, fate can. Fate can's on uh, on mobile, not on a regular screen. So that's why he can't, can't quite make out the arrow. Nope, no excuses. <laughs> Where did Chambalaya go? There he is, he's offline. So I'd say Andrew recovered really well from what looked like a horrible position. So now he can face the whole swarm at Dengar and probably takes the uh, Kashyyyk defender off the board before it fires. Yeah, it has, yeah. And then it has it's looking well. a lot better. Yeah, he should get both shots on it here. Oh, Asaj shot the Kashyyyk defender. That was in range. Oh, okay. There Did he? Go. Oh, yeah, he that's... just has the target lock for nothing then? I guess. I don't know. That doesn't make sense. But he definitely I, heard a Y-Wing, so the, think, the overlay must not yeah. be updated. I saw he hit the Y wing and Dengar hurt the Wookiee that was hurt already. No, okay, you like, the, he was in the second Y wing took uh took ah, two there shields. It is. Yeah, took two. Yeah. So Dengar was able to to put in some work against the Kashyyyk defender. So here's the question, right? So Andrew took quite a bit of damage. Um, you know, he's he was going through rocks for, the, for, 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 for positioning. Was it worth it? That's the question. If you Sorry, did the hard two, it's definitely clear of that block, and that looks really good. The hard one looks really close, so it should be blocked. So if he gets that block, I don't know if it's quite enough, though. It means he won't have a focus, but he's still going to have arc on the Wookiee that's low. Yeah. So, so the... no, actually, no K4, though, because it's a white turn. 
So the block could be really valuable if he gets it. He still he still has expertise though. Like yeah, you just can't get another torp off, and uh, no focus for defense could be big as well. Does anyone know what R five astromech does? R <laughs> five. <laughs> Yeah, R5 Astromech's the flip over ship crits one. What? Yeah, why? I don't know. I mean, what else? Like, R2 Astromech doesn't actually help you, so whatever. So why not? I would, like, just take R3A2 and have yeah, a 360 on one. one stress. Who cares? Uh, well, it's only in your arc for R3A2. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought that was just the BTLA4. I don't like that Asajj move. I probably would have just gone straight. But yeah, I, I don't because now his arc's facing the wrong way. He's gonna, yeah, he's gonna turn. Feels bad, but yeah. he has push, so he still has one offensive mod to kill that OK, which is probably enough. Uh, I like how he spins both markers. What you need to do is make them disagree and then call a judge when they don't. Very <laughs> make your judge very sad. The best thing about this move is that he gets the uh, no reinforced uh, shot on the Wookie. Yeah. Yep, and then also he's gonna be able to stress uh, at least the Y wing. Gonna be able to stress the Y wing at least. Might be able to reach yep. that other Wookie. Their greens aren't great. Hmm. Dangar, is it the one or the two turn? Show us. Or another three bank, and then just make it home. Escort mission complete. It's the one. It's a so one. See. So yeah, that that should bump. Yes, sir. So it turns out that was a really good move by the Wookie. I mean, it's one less shot on Dengar, too, so it's not, like, the worst for Dengar yeah. either, but... Because Dengar no spent his for... target lock last turn, right? Yeah, so yeah. he only has expertise for mods. There's a chance that Kashyyyk Defender lives, but really unlikely. He has no focus for taking four TLT shots, so I think that's worth it. Yeah, well, I mean, the, the Wookiee Defender has four, effectively five hull, so I don't know. It's not, like, he could live. I believe in him. Is it the one? Is the one bumping him not the uh, the one that's full? Yeah, the one bumping is full. Okay. Yeah, it would have been even better if he got that guy in the block. So if he does leave, that's going to be the move next turn. Well, and if the if the if he if Adam chooses to shoot with his Azatug against Dengar, Dengar's going to get two two cracks at it. Anyway. Yeah, I I think he'll decline that shot. Yeah, but the Y wing shoot first, which is interesting. Mm -hmm. So. Really, Dengar has to decide whether or not that Azatuk shoots. This is very or... true. I'm forgetting that they're PS1. And it's six dice into that Wookiee with one reinforced. So, yeah, this is, I don't know, pretty good chance to live. So he like one natural. He chooses to go after the Azatuk here. And uh, looks... It's range one, and that guy's super hosed, but, you know. It is range one. All right, he oh. he hits the box. Blanks. Hits. Hits, baby. Hits for days. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Put the disrespect reinforced down. All right, takes two. He's halfway there. Doesn't get a reinforce for this one either. Could be range three. Looks like it because he was trying to stress the Y wing out there that's about the same distance away. Where's Chambly? Uh, he was getting on. He told got, him to let me know when he was ready. He got lost. He'll, he'll find his way. Daddy, no! All right, so he's he's going balls out here. He's like, I'm going to spend one it. One of eight here, and he looks good lit. Oh. oh. Spend. You gotta, you gotta, he's dead, yeah? Yep. Because that's not a focus, it's reinforced. That would have been really big. So Y wings uh, get a chance to decide what they're going to go against. Um, one of the Y wings is both of the Y wings are in Dengar's arc, and Dengar has not used his ability yet. So more shots. All right, Y wings go going at Dengar. He said, "I got you." Oh, I'm surprised you didn't do the other one first, so that Dengar could potentially waste his shot. Like you know, On always give your opponent. Three. Yeah. Yeah, always give your opponent the chance to screw it up. Uh, it looks really good for Dengar Asajj now. Yeah. Just because, like, Asajj... I mean, Asajj doesn't like TLTs, but she can clean up against... Yeah, like at least, two, she'll at least okay. 
Yeah, like two of these ships. Yeah, Andrew's like very quickly getting below the threshold that he needs to be high, like the damage threshold to kill Asajj with Dengar still on the board. Yeah, absolutely. And honestly, uh, Andrew has not taken that much damage considering uh, Adam having that, making great calls and being in the right position. He just you know, didn't have the dice mods. He chose to go through a couple rocks. It just didn't happen. I guess that block really kind of backfired. Yeah. That extra damage into Dengar could be like some big crits that matter. Mm hmm. Because, I mean, what? Uh, Dengar would have had uh, a focus for defense? Yep. Yeah, and you get. Yeah. But at we'll the same the time, pocket. at the same time, you get another He'd shot. Eating. Yeah, four dice. Range wound. That always but feels... yeah, now that Wookiee is not doing anything for a couple turns. Yep, yeah, it's it's out. It's gonna have to go to the left, or do like a self bump. But I don't think that's the right call. Uh, did Dengar really not take like any damage there? He took like one from two TLTs. Looks like it. Yeah. With no focus. Wow. Okay then. Dengar is high variance on defense. <laughs> sometimes he lives forever, and sometimes he goes down like a sack of bricks. That's right. It's the new Dangaroo guys just roll natties. That's how you do it. It's true. You don't <laughs> need dice mods if you just roll evades. Think Asajj, what what is she going to be doing in here? Probably coming. She doesn't have to come in too aggressive. I mean, she has she has a lot of room to move. Maybe the something two like straight a two straight. Okay. Two straight. Yeah, there you go. She stressed to the two straight or the three bank. It's a question of whether that. Y wing tries to block the three bank with like a one bank, so that'd be the only concern with doing that. I mean, would would the safe move? Yeah. Oh wait, she, she's stressed. Okay, can't, yeah. Can't. There's no reason not to two straight that I can think of or see. Uh, yeah, I mean the three bank is greedier, but I think you have to two straight to be safe. But then you're if you two straight your three turn, yeah, it still fits fine. And it'll be really hard to block unless the Y wing is like two moves ahead of you here. These guys are playing at a pretty good place. Way to go, Australia. Good More than 11 pounds here? Uh, no, there's still... This is like 8. Oh, I don't even think we're in turn 8, are we? Asajj was seven. there. Seven. Right, so then are we going to get... 2, 3, 4... We're yeah, we're about on turn 7. 7, there you go. 6 or 7-ish, somewhere in that ballpark. Do you agree with bringing the Ys close like that? That seems like no, the opposite. No, definitely not. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, and what's... Oh, okay. The super Ooh. aggressive three hard. Rampant right. greed, baby. Don't... Reward it. Hey, hey to do the Andrew, it worked. It worked. Okay. <laughs> Who are you to judge? He just doesn't give a fuck about where his arc is. <laughs> That's fine. I mean, the Y-Wing is still stressed, so it turned out not to be a big deal. He clears the stress, just target lock focus and blow some stuff up. See if Dangar does the one bank and just they just kill these Y wings in a horrible dumpster fire, or even the yeah. sloop and just target lock the one that's already like about to die. Yeah, this Dangar's sloop. I don't think that fits. Oh yeah, go straight. I mean that's just, safe yeah, choice. Just kill it. He's like I'm a, I'm a turret. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Nothing <laughs> matters. Y wings. The stress Y wings doesn't even have a shot. I guess that was the advantage of the massage move. It's, it's strange one of that why. I mean, the three bank wanted that too. But Yeah. Well, now I don't know where massage can go next turn. Two uh, the five straight. Fully stressed. Probably, uh, that's true. The four straight doesn't clear, probably. Oh, the and disrespect no stress on this Y wing that's super dead. I love it. I mean, probably the smart move is to do some type of self-bumping to keep some space back. I, I guess we can't see the edge there, so we don't know how far he'd be able to go. Yeah. I don't think it's a choice in the self-bump situation. It's probably going to happen. All right, so it looks like a lot of damage is going through. Is that four? He threw focus. Three or four. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> Rip that Y-Wing. He tried. An innocent thug had a family to go help. Sorry, an innocent gold squadron pilot. So like I said, thug. <laughs> My guy, no. <laughs> that, was, that was Brandon. <laughs> it was. He's not been, anymore, it's not. He has a family. 
Nope. Two hits and a crit. Throws an evade. All he has is a grave. But yeah, Dengar got off one torp this game, and if he had like countermeasures and glitter instead, that probably would have been even better. So it seems like the squad is still pretty good. No, don't play Dengar <laughs> anymore. He's bad. I promise. Oh yeah, my bad. I mean, unhinged is probably the biggest nerf. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. Andrew, Chris is telling you not to say the truth. That way, every. I mean, you know, Travis or Nami already spilled the beans on your podcast. So this is true. true. Cats out of the bag. Nami, get get it together, Nami. <laughs> we give useful advice, not advice, not that useful advice. <laughs> Secret tech, baby. So Dengar's got to take two to be a half. Massage has to take three. Do we think either of them are going to get the half? Probably Dengar will. The something, yeah, Dengar, with the positioning, Dengar most likely. Asajj might end up getting uh, blocked by one of the Y wings. I mean, this point. is an awkward turn for Dengar Asajj for sure. Yeah, well, you just one turn Dengar, yep. like two straight Asajj, and just try to torp the the Wookiee, like whatever. And then you can barrel roll Dengar if you have to instead to uh, yeah, not you're get probably going to barrel roll, but then you're no target lock. That's a uh, white turn. I mean, you could also just one turn into a Saj, get your free target lock, and just light up that Y wing because the Y wing's probably stuck at range one no matter what. Yeah, I, I actually like that more. Assuming, I mean, the four straight might clear for a Saj, so you might go for that for some reason, but it's not a good move. The dice won't allow Dengar to be nerfed. The more FFG nerfs Dengar, the stronger his dice become. <laughs> Fear will keep the other factions in line. Fear of his dice. That's right. Thanks, chat. I mean, Dengar's been good since he came out, right? I mean, there's so the fact that you can attack two times is just great. It's a pretty good strategy, just attacking twice. And the thing is that it's it's an ability that is easy to get off consistently. Yeah. Like just joust things. Yep. Pointed things. Yeah. So yeah, if he does the two straight or self bump one turn, he'll be looking pretty good. He's gonna try to get through there. Oh, he's okay. He actually thinks this is gonna clear. I don't no, know. I maybe don't... he just wants the better angle. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, you can see they're not being super precise about it. He doesn't look surprised. I hope he's not surprised. <laughs> oh, no. Choo choo tracks. All right, well, while they're being precise and slow, I'm going to look at standings. Do it. What's in the box? Yeah. Uh, at Andrew's dials are uh, sponsored by Andrew. Of Curled Paw Creatives. Those beautiful Oh, are those covers. the Curled Paw ones? Yeah. Andrew is in Andrew Australia. Knuckles. Yep. Yeah. So there's only one 3-0 and o so far. So games are still, they're still turning them in. Lachlan Moore. You got to see who pulls ahead in the MOV race between Travis and Jaren. Ty. Ty. No, no, no. There must be, there must always be a Foss King. Do we know who's winning? I mean, sorry, do we know what they're flying? Uh yeah, Jaren is playing uh Dengar Nim and Travis is playing Dash Miranda. Mangler, Mangler Dash Miranda. Dash. I would have barreled a range one there. Cause I mean you're not too afraid of the Wookiee shot because that's an extra range one shot you get on the Wookiee. Well he's so probably a trade for you. He's probably just gonna he already has two shields down on the Y Wing. So just focus down the Y Wing. I mean, you could be range one of both, and then you're just threatening the range one shot. The double range one shot. Like, it discourages the Wookiee because it's a better trade for you because he has wired versus your expertise. I don't know. I mean, it's not. It's like Wookiee commandos. It's different. Okay. Sorry. I'm just <laughs> calling it wired. That's the calculator. Yeah. All right. Decisions, decisions. What are you going to do, Andrew? How hard? The other advantage of having Dengar farther forward is it cleared some room for a Saj. He's going to have the same problem this turn. Yeah. Next. Did I miss combat? Nope. Hasn't happened shoot. yet. Yeah, okay. Uh, or are we, just... I guess Dengar's deciding what to shoot. Yep. He's deciding gotcha. how hard he wants to win. Like, do I just focus fire or do I just start taking out the Wookiee, which will be annoying. So we'll find out. It's a good start. Good. Bunch of natties. Turns out natties are pretty easy to get with... Uh, so All right, so that's two off the Wookiee. And Asajj, hoping a dream. Over, it's not like the, over average. The Y-Wing's not hurting anything this turn. 
Yeah. No rush. And takes one. Yeah, this is this is going by very quickly. <laughs> so does the Wookiee take the shot here? He probably does just to try to get some of them a beat, right? Yeah, yeah. That, that's where he's at right now. Oh, Dengar is actually a five hole, so yeah, you definitely take it. Wired! Wookiees! Not Wookiees. No reroll. Easy. Now nah, he blinks. You needed a sack to do the Wookiee roar for him. <laughs> I would do it if my daughter wasn't sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I guess the TLT can go into Asajj. That's what this is. Gotcha. Did it, did Asajj take damage? Or is a... Uh... What is it? rolls? What rolls two red dice? Oh, it's one off camera. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, What's going on? The edge. I'm amazed that lots hasn't been triggered yet. Like, how does Asajj just tank damage from TLT without needing lots, without having one evade be the difference once? It happens when you don't get shot and you roll natties. That's fair. Mm -hmm. Or you roll a whole bunch of blanks to a bunch of natties. And you got half points, buddy. Lost how much HP for it? I guess he didn't even Four. take that much of the revenge. Because he yeah. is at range 2. I think that's why... I don't know. Like, I would have been range 1 of the Wookiee there. But then you're more likely to take half points, too. So, yeah. it's hard to say what the right decision is. Yeah, I mean, worst comes to worst. Uh, Dengar might die. Maybe. Um, and then Do you I think... just... Go ahead. Do you, do you just force straight Asajj here and hope it clears? Like, whatever. Worst case is it doesn't. Yeah, that seems correct. I don't know if you have the space to two turn back, though. Uh, you well, if you're, if you're at 45 degrees. If you're not off the board, yeah. yeah. And he's, and he's, more, he's even less than that, yeah. yeah. So, yeah, he uh, really... can't get himself into a scenario where he's too close to the board edge to turn, as long as he goes straight. The one like, right on Dengar looks amazing here. See? Thought of that. He dials in a one forward. Just gonna scoot him up. Yep. Woo wee. Train I tracks. feel like when Asajj hits you with those engines, it should do damage. <laughs> like, that looks painful. Are there bigger engines on a like ship in an X-wing? Have you seen <laughs> Tyler's decimator? I don't. I think that also Oiken does do damage when he hits you, so. Right. Because he's a minivan that bangs into oh, the Oh, what a god. He clears. So then the real question is do you barrel roll here to get him an arc for the disrespect? Like, extra kill him? <laughs> no, you take you take the focus <laughs> for defense. I guess it depends which no, way that you reinforces. Just take focus. a target lock and you torch the wiling, I think. It, yeah, well, I mean, if the reinforce is the, to the rear, I would definitely barrel roll into arc, but I don't. I think it, he did it to the front, so you might as well. Like, that Wookiee might just die here. Oh, he's target locking the Y. I think that's the right move. For the revenge yeah. shot. I mean, Asajj is taking... Or, sorry, Dengar's not taking any shot from the Wookiee here, so killing the Wookiee's not a priority. You yeah, could potentially kill the gold if you get lucky with Asajj here. Yep, and you already lost half points. So... There, so. It, you're, it's it's so unlikely that Asajj gets half points no matter what, so you might as well yeah, just fair. take the best trades. And that's four hits. Chips, baby. Dice are so good. <laughs> that's a very defeated roll, this, Adam. Like, how could this happen? Shouldn't that be two hits, two crits? Yeah. No. Wait, what? Did he not guide the ships to a crit? He did. He has to. It's it's against he the rules. He has to. Although that, that backup isn't in effect yet, so it's debatable. That's probably a pretty interesting thing for the marshals there. Like, do, how, how do I choose this? Like, I guess the yeah. upgrade things you can't do anything about, but... Well, usually you use the uh, the new yeah. rulings, like clarification, like actual clarifications, because no, nothing okay. changed there. It's just, like, what do they actually mean? Right. Like, there's no reason not to use the minefield mapper stuff. But you didn't know what they meant until they said what they meant, and they said that it doesn't mean anything till November. So lies, Chris. <laughs> no, it doesn't mean anything until just before U.S. Nationals, like the article said. 
I was there. It meant nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Natties. N A T T I E S. Maybe he is going to get half points here. I assume that's into mm. Asajj for points, right? Yeah. Shooting Dengar there, suicide. Yeah, so Asajj didn't quite do enough damage, huh? Yeah. Oh, shit. There's three hits from the Wookiee. Yeah, he got half on Asajj. All right, so it's a tie game, uh, but the pilot skill advantage, of course, is going to be able to ride Andrew to victory here. Kill one this turn. Damage, but I guess Asajj has been actionless for two turns, which is pretty rough. Yeah. True. Like, I think Asajj alone could probably clean this game up. Oh, yeah. Well, sure. maybe not. Depending, like, 27 TLT minutes. TLT is scary um, for her if the TLT is at range. But yeah, she's fast enough, though, she'd be able to close range one. Yeah, just one of them is not an issue. And, but if, yeah, uh... I expect, I expect uh, Adam to take, like, zero damage this next round because he should take the Wyoming off the board and Asajj might not even, like, take a shot from the Wookiee. Well, the Wookiee too hard, right? Yeah, every time. Yep. And I would hard turn with this one. I don't know. Hard turn focus, baby. See if you can buy your Y-Wing some time. There's the two turn. Everybody knew it. The, no ones, the one straight with Asajj is probably the best. Uh, it might not, not have marked the Wookiee, though. So he does the reinforce. Wyoming, yep, take the one straight. Just accept your fate. What are you doing, Asajj? Don't do anything crazy. I think, I think the one straight's probably still best for Asajj, even if he doesn't have the Wookiee arc, because you're just trying to... I don't know. Wait, is that the Y-Wing flipping a crit? Yep. Are there any crits that aren't ship crits that you have to roll for? Did he bring R5 Astromech and forget it? <laughs> uh, he wants the defender. I guess. Grab the, grab grab your damage deck. I mean, let's just let's see. I don't have enough screens. All my let's screens are the filled. Wiki. Critical hit cards, action, console fire, damage sensor array, blue stabilizer, major hull breach. Actually, this assage move is correct. He should evade and probably just focus here. Dengar bumps Asajj. So Dengar finishes the gold squadron, hopefully by himself. It's a little risky, but he has focus target locks. So I think it's safe. And then Asajj, well, I mean, Asajj is evade and lats against the Wookiee and can trade effectively there. So I would focus evade with Asajj and then just... Looks, he's going for the target lock. He's going aggressive here. And then what, one turn, Dengar. No, there's no way that's going to come here. Yeah, just ram yeah. and you get focus. I mean, you have expertise K4, so it's fine. Yeah, and then you get the revenge shot on the Y-Wing, so, yeah, so, so why not? So what's, And if the Y-Wing doesn't have a shot on the Sarge, then it's perfect. So what's the conclusion on the uh, on the damage deck? Yeah, there aren't any pilot crits that have uh, an so, action on so them. So he forgot. Probably, or it's not actually R5 Astromech. That's also a possibility. That's it could true. be R5. No, because he turned and didn't clear stress. So it's some Astromech that got forgotten at some point. I don't know why else you'd be rolling it die. Oh, what a god. Four. Get him. He has to roll the dice, guys. So, dealing some cards. Should be pulling that gold squadron off the table here. I think that was the Wookiee, wasn't it? That might have been another orb at the Wyoming. I'm not sure what happened. Yeah. Oh, no, I think it was, it's range one into the Wookiee because that's where the target locks are. Oh, yeah. And then Asajj is going to attempt to not do what she just did with a bunch of blanks. Yeah. And then he's forcing the gold to TLT Dengar and then boss right. to die. Anyways. And, like, Dengar's already a half. Farewell, Wookiee. Got him. Yeah, that was really well played by Andrew. To I liked it. Come back here. Because it could have gone real bad. Probably one of the things that hurt Adam quite a bit was the fact that when he did have good positioning with the Wookiees, the Y-Wings were really far back. So they weren't getting in any shots. And the Rocks, I mean, they 
they did really help Andrew as well by like he drew the whole swarm through there and that spread them out and made them go over rocks and stuff to keep on Dengar. Oh god. So Jeremy is uh he hit update now on Skype, so we might be <laughs> waiting a little bit. Excellent. Oh, this is crazy. If if Jeremy's in here, we have like the north, the south, the east, and the west of the United States all like right here. We got you surrounded by crates. <laughs> this is the compass. Is Jeremy a crate? I mean I think I'm not so. officially a crate either, so Whatever. You are now. I need you to surround Dio and you're a crate. What? Okay. Why am I, how am I surrounded? Just, just I am, for the purposes I'm, of this. I am the north border. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not. Zach is the north border. White walkers? Oh, I guess that, yeah, he is more north than I am, isn't he? All right, so it looks like uh, Adam calls it there. He's like, all right, this is this is done. We're, we're done. I mean, he might have just died to revenge because I think he TLT'd and got revenge. <laughs> just finish. Just kill me. Kill me. I want to die. You could have done the five straight off the board there, too. That would have been pretty satisfying. It is always very satisfying to deny your opponent the kill. Yep. I go out my way, sir. At Worlds, I had a uh, T70. My last game, I had a T70, a one hull uh, against his entire list that I had just barely half points, one ship, flew onto a rock, didn't pop integrated to kill myself. Can't, Can't make me play. So next round will be starting at 3 p.m. Brisbane time, which I assume is 35 minutes from now, according to chat. I, be- I believe it. These so, are fast games. Let me look at uh, the standings. What's in the box? So Dan Stallard is the top player at 571 MOV. Hey, guys, oh. that that was like like 10 or 11 turns. It was. It's weird how that works out. But you don't use the data from games that go to completion... Right. I use for all, that side. I use everything, sir. Everything. I thought the eleven rounds was just for games that went to time. Nope. Yeah, regardless of games that go to time, it's like always eleven turns. It's, yep. it's kind of spooky. So Travis Foss lost his game, according to this. Jaron is still going on. Oh. How's Papa Foss doing? It's like the only people I know over there. Which dice? Papa Foss is still one. Which one. dice did he bring? Did he bring? <laughs> we we told Jaron to bring his good dice. <laughs> did so now? Just do, always double check, guys. Always double check. Did, did I bring all my symbols with me? My uh, most recent regional dies have the the crit painting is on one of the hits, so I had a heart attack when I noticed. Like, and <laughs> the hit painting is on the crit, so there's like a little bit of extra white on the crit and like a little hole on the hit. Not like enough that you'd ever actually mistake. And it was like, oh no. Do I have a mispainted one too? So, but no, I have nothing to blame all my losses on, Boom. sadly. And Travis still made the top 16 in Worlds despite that. So This is very true. And uh, I don't know if you guys remember, I was saying, like, oh, I want to go back and look at the tape to see if I could tell if the dice or whatever. He was already using the top, uh, like the... Oh, the top 32 dice. The top 32 dice. So uh, as long as those aren't messed up, he... His dice were fine, at least in that game. But he lost anyway. They're, they're way below average, trust me. <laughs> Believe me. They're the worst. It's funny. The dice that I think I hear complained about the most are those, uh, the milky dice. The white. The dice that I hear complained about the most are, the, like, the bottom table dice. It's very odd. With, like, <laughs> subpar lists that are being played poorly. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why there's like a weird correlation there. Those guys should get their dice checked. It's true. <laughs> you should steep them in uh, salt water. You gotta win see which dice. ones are best. Uh, the risk keep getting richer. It's true. Well, I broke something here. What? What? Are, why? Why'd you break it? My. Let's see. I'm trying to like not have a full screen chat window, and it is not giving me. What? You know what? I'm just not gonna click anything because I don't wanna break it. All right. So yeah, we we have another game here in about thirty minutes. Somebody asked me to uh, put on uh, put on some music and sing them a song. Uh, I'll take some. I'll take requests. Oh God, Ben, that is not the response I thought you were going to give me. That so you should put on like karaoke of um, Magic Carpet Ride and then sing the Sunter song that came out this week. Yes, please. We'll just watch. I can play the Mario Kart remix we played. I can get you the lyrics. 
I, I'll take I'll take some lyrics. Hit me up. Alright. <laughs> so oh so no no. <laughs> Whenever I'm on Twitch chat is when I I drop some like random things that I'm working on because not all my listeners watch and not all the watchers listen. You know, it's one of those. Weird yeah, it's thing. a secret between you and everybody who's watching Twitch chat. Exactly, exactly. So one one little side project that I'm working on for Worlds is like um, uh, like hardcore gangster rap. Um, uh, that's that's all related to X Wing. Have you publicly released that one song? Because that was really good. Uh, no, that was just like the little preview that I gave you guys. That that one wasn't as hardcore. Like there's there's a pretty. Uh, you know, there's 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 like one that's just hardcore, like trash in the crates, the entire thing. Like it's just nice. It's just like a like a like a hate fuck. Um, hey, this is a Christian uh, Gold Squadron podcast stream, <laughs> sir. Right. Please watch your language. <laughs> I'm, for, I'm forgetting because I'm with you. Dang it! Uh, <laughs> I already dropped it. I kind of regretted it. I wasn't sure. What sorry, people. Here. Sorry, people. He's uh, not sorry. I hear no regret in his voice. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So it's it's fun. Uh, there's there's definitely one about spinning dials. Uh, nice. Why? Uh, That's weird. Why would anyone relate you with spinning dials? I don't I, understand. I don't, I don't know either. So this, it'll it'll be fun. Hopefully people understand that it's not serious, because most of the things I do are super serious. This won't. That's be. your that's your mistake. It's I nice. The uh, lyrics in Twitch chat, by the way. That's what I read it in. In Twitch chat, yes. Yeah. So people hold you accountable. <laughs> All right, hold on. I, I need to make this a new tab. But if you want to, you could just like play some of the ones you have recorded already, like the comboing one. But that one is, yeah, it's not hardcore for sure. No, yeah, it's it's too it's too uh it's nice. Yeah, let's get in trouble with Disney. Play it, play the, give us the background music. I'm ready. Oh, I can, you need, I can, I can find it if you want. Shine. this. Doing all the field splendid. research. Right. We we need the background music. Yeah, right. yeah you I, can't I go without it. it. I gotta find it. here. I got you. Hold on. What'd you Did do? you cover What's... their logo with your logo on accident? You monster. That was just the first time. I fixed Can it. Can you go to karaoke version? <laughs> that just... that, that's what I'm going to look for. Yeah, YouTube. Yeah. I can listen to them so you don't have it on the stream. Uh... This one's probably good. See, but, see, but if you play it on your side, it's going to be... No. I'm just saying before we... Before you go live, I can check them out for you. It's my producer over here. Yeah. This is the clean track, work. yo. This is the clean track. It's not like we have like 30 minutes to kill straight nothing to do. You better do this <laughs> fast. <laughs> and the first one I think sounds okay. It's not quite as good as the actual music, though. So if you want, you can just sing over If you write actual. anything on your computer, you need to get uh, Grammarly. I write pretty much so we're also all sponsored day, by Grammarly. And Grammarly makes my writing better. As can you guys hear the background music? I can't hear anything. You can't hear it. Oh wait, I lost oh. the lyrics. Ah, uh, got it. Hold on. You need the music and the lyrics. Yes, I have the music. It's just that it went to four. Is that how songs work, Chris? That's how movies work. Oh. I also need the notation, please. Thank you. I'm a real musician. That's true. Fake news. You're overqualified for this. <laughs> Where the hell are those things? Oh, there it is. Am I really? Go am I really about to do this? So, uh, breaking news, oh. Chambly has to go to bed and can't get Skype to work. So he said, enjoy Not America. He's putting $5 on Nim. $5 on Nim. <laughs> yep. Make it happen. All right, I'll take him up on it. I put $5 on Wookiees, so I'll take that. I'll put, I'll put $5 on anything but Nim. That's a pretty safe bet, right? <laughs> That's at least 50-50. Yep. Uh, I don't know how that how works. Do we have the list juggler for what people brought? I guess that doesn't make sense because um, we don't have results. Never mind. Yeah, I don't Take that think, back. I don't think we have it yet. Somebody give me a breakdown. Where are you, Australian person who gives has all the lists? Come on. <laughs> all right. Did any rounds games finish up? Tell the Fosses to finish their games faster so they can give us updates. Yep. Come on, Fosses. I'm over here about to sing karaoke. <laughs> Save us. This is happening. You guys can't hear the background music, but everybody else can hear I can show you the world. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, that's a really high key. I, am, I can't do that right now. It's too damn loud. Why not? Yes, you can do it. It's do it. Be very, just one, not very, not very, be very watch loud. your goddamn language. And two, yes, you can. I believe in you. Okay. I'll try again. You got it. I'll pretend, got to, it. I'll pretend to care. Here we go. Let's do it. Where's, like, the low-key version? Like, come on, guys. What? <laughs> yeah, it's it's Andrew, dude. Here. really high dude i can't do that right now do it that'll be fine my daughter is sleeping she so would... go sing it to her yeah. it'll be so wholesome uh, I'll, I'll sing it I'll, I'll sing it in my my low sultry voice <clears throat> i need my lemon water thank you i need a change of pants Shimmering splendid Tell me soon tear now when did you last let your palp decide I can open your eyes Take you token by token Barrel rolling and boosting on a magic nerfing ride a whole new Oh, no. A new fantastic FAQ No one to bump or bomb No bricks to shoot Or say they all got a tiny A whole new world A dazzling ace I never knew But when I am way up here It's crystal clear that now I am in a whole new world with you. Mm. Wow. All right, was, I got my finger amazing. on the Twitch clip button. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I really wanted to make a duet, but I wasn't sure where the, the Jasmine part began, because clearly you were a lot in there. <laughs> or a sister fellow, I guess. <laughs> that was fun. Generating clip All right, uh, where does this start? I forget that Twitch can do that. Yeah, it can. You were set up the whole time. <laughs> Front page of Reddit, here we come. They oh. can only be a minute long. Why were we born to suffer? <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Twitch chat thing. <laughs> I think. I don't know. So, is there anybody actually watching through YouTube? There are some people watching on YouTube. Generating Hi, YouTube. All right, where does this start? I forget that Twitch. Oh, oh, audio loop started. Don't do that. Uh, we'll make this pop up. All right, YouTube so chat, I'm like sorry for seconds. ignoring you. There's actually quite a few people watching through uh, through YouTube as well. All righty. We'll close that out. That was fun. All right, what next, boys? <laughs> how, I'm still working on this Twitch clip. How many, You're on how, your own. <laughs> how many minutes did we burn? <laughs> you got 24 to go. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> or is our pal base mirror to take us the time? Come on, guys. <laughs> is this where we switch over to a Vassal game? Aren't there other dash national games going on? Yeah, Vassal sounds good. Oh, God. I don't, ha I don't have enough. You're right, Chris. I don't have enough screens. I need, like, at least four to do all you the do. things I want to do. You really do, don't you? I do. See, the thing is, I'm also doing this all off a laptop. So it's hard to get. Why do you hate yourself? Because... Like, use all that dirty internet money to not suffer. Like, what? Because <laughs> yeah, uh, I spend it, I spend it on the people, man. The people don't deserve it. Next time we're at an event, like, just use my phone because I have unlimited data, so you can probably. See, you know, uh, everybody <laughs> everybody says that, like, oh, my unlimited data. I'm like, but did you check it for hotspot? And they go, oh yeah, no way, I got like one. I, I I have a hotspot and I shouldn't throttle because I have like some through work because I used to work on phones. Ah, okay. So you're cheating. Yes. I like it. That's fine. Wait, I need to get Andrew on the record at some point complaining about something at Skype on this. <laughs> send it to my boss. Yes. So I can Sorry. send it over to uh, I don't know if there aren't any competitors <laughs> to Skype yeah. anymore. Send it to Cisco, whatever. <laughs> 
Isn't Google Hangouts considered a uh, a competitor? I think you have to have users to have like Hangouts really blew their lead there. They really did. It's like it's really impressive that you could try to compete with something like Skype and lose. <laughs> I mean, we have the name brand going for us. It's true. But I mean, they they got the you know like the live stream thing. And I think and... I mean Facebook chat's kind of taking over the world too. So why can I not make Twitch clips longer than a minute? It needs to be a minute and a half. And you can link to the video when it comes out at the timestamp. That's probably the best thing you can do if you want yeah. the full version. That's fair. We do need the full version. All right, Twitch chat, I have a mission for you. It's like unlimited karma. <laughs> when there's a VOD of this, when I wake up tomorrow, I need to open Reddit and see Dion Morales <laughs> Jesus. sings oh, us a beautiful rendition of I Can Show You the World, or whatever <laughs> that song's called. <clears throat> Sorry for my out of tuneness at first. I'm telling Reddit you, keep, to apply like the Canadian on Reddit for the lyrics. We could just go around in a circle on how much we talk about how much we love Suntir Fell. I'd be down for that. And why we love Suntir Fell. Does Dion even like Suntir Fell now? He does now. I, I mean, I sang a song about him. I have to now. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's in my contract. Suntir's the jazz mentor, Aladdin. This is correct. You know, I, w- I was told in music school, like, if you don't feel it, don't sing it slash play it. Yeah, it's like acting. Right. Like... You have to do believe you, it. Are you a method singer? <laughs> a method singer. <laughs> do you uh, get deep into the, the spirit, like get in character for your sheet music? Absolutely. Good. Like, I think if you watched me like play like in an orchestra, you would just laugh your ass off. What's your instrument, Dion? I guarantee that's true, but yeah. you probably wouldn't deserve it. No. I just wouldn't be able to keep a straight face. <laughs> so, um, so in most orchestras, I'll play viola. Mm-hmm. Uh, because a lot of people don't play viola. It's really strange. But, uh, yeah, I usually play viola. Um, Everyone wants to play violin. They want to... What's the viola violin oh, meta? Like, who's on top here? So, I mean, violin is the chair master or whatever. Like, so, uh, like, the thing is people are fooled into thinking that violin is the best, but it turns out because everybody plays violin, you just got a bunch of violins knocking violins out, and violas are just... There. There's way more competition for violin, but you get the right. melodies and stuff, which is nice. Yeah. I interrupt this broadcast for very important news. There is a vassal room called Faster Than Lasers open. Faster than with laser. theorist in it and Matthew Blanc, who I don't know, but there's a lot of wholesomeness in it. <gasps> you can play gunboats on vassal now. I forgot. Yeah. And they're all named after like what is Kra- Karsabi? What is Karsabi? I should know that reference. <laughs> That's the name of the actual guy. There's, there's oh, it's, it sounds like a like a World War II Japanese fighter. It's like Could be where it comes from. Karsabi. I mean, the yeah, I googled the, Karsabi, and the first thing was actually the Gamer, Axis so. in this scenario. Karsabi is a sweet name. Why is he terrible? That's sad. Is it actually? Show. Is it Vinder? Is that what it is? No, no, no. It's the PS5 guy that says actually your weapons aren't disabled. You're stressed. Oh, no, that's bad. Don't play that. Yep. Don't tell the people what to do. They can bring him with Yor and Countdown all they want. It'll be great. with Wired. Yeah. <laughs> I want the people to, to, like, have fun. No, you don't. You played Fair Ship at Nationals. I don't believe you. <laughs> I had fun playing it. <laughs> this is their chance. Cause you said people. Really Are you more than one person? Don't even any armor. What's up? I don't Points. want people to have fun. Okay. So you're not lying to yourself. No, I'm, not, I'm telling the truth. <laughs> Uh-oh, Jaron 100 owed his game. He might be the top in movie now. Too late to buy you Jaren but Mandalor now. Uh, you, don't tell me what I can't do. I'll go and act like there's no big nerf, and then make the judge try to straight face tell me that it's nerfed. It'd be great. <laughs> Once per Just game? Um, Isn't every round a game? It. Yeah. Tell me where a game is defined in the rules. This Nowhere. It's probably not. Do you... <laughs> Yo. Oh no, it's probably not, is it? <laughs> it is the first thing that says once per game, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Rules reference. Everything else says discard because it's like a card, not a power. Game. Oh boy, is there, is there any other once per game Break. effects? Not not on a pilot ability. If it's on right. a card, you can discard it. Winning the game. Winning the game is defined. Hey. Well, my uh, 
Welcome to real time crate research. <laughs> Arguing with Mandalore judges about what a game is. No, a single game consists of four phases. Oh, a single game round. Nope, we're still in the clear. Okay. Yep, you see? It's a, it's 11 rounds. So every 11 rounds, you are allowed <laughs> to use his ability. I've declared it. Yep. Uh, let's see. Before playing, set up the game as follows. Okay. It's kind of defined. Gather forces, determine initiative, place obstacles, place forces, activate shields. Also, the fact is straight wrong. I would like to note somebody posted it on our Facebook. Hmm. Um, the fact says if you place Han on a rock, you have to roll for it and suffer a shield. You haven't powered up your shields yet. But you haven't activated your shields until after all the ships are placed. Boom. FFG. Pew, 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 pew. If you play that way, then everyone doesn't power up their shields so they have no shields. That's true. So I guess no one has shields. That's interesting. Soon tier just got a lot better. Again. <laughs> there are game components. Tracking tokens are used to track the number of rounds during a game. Okay. The game ends at the end of a round. The game ends in a draw. This isn't the turn. It all seems to allude to what a game is. It does. They've they've teased. <laughs> They is, they're trying is, to tease it out of me. Is there nothing that says, like, the game ends when an opponent's ships have all been destroyed or something like that? No, because the game ends at the end of a round, not when all the ships are destroyed. I learned, like... I mean, the game has a defined end, beginning and end, it sounds like. So yeah, I, I, think, I think I can't rules lawyer my way out of that. I'll just get kicked out of the tournament, not also be right and still get kicked out of the tournament, it'll sadly. Be, it'll be fine. What a way to go, though. Oh, what a legend. Watch, we can watch a guy from my store on Vassal. A fellow son of Akbar. Although he'd probably really not appreciate it. You can put your club slash affiliation in tabletop TO. Why do we not use this? So I can just enter everyone as crates, whether they want to be or not. Let's, and then if they start losing... Vanguard, Sajrus, Nim, Dash. It's... No, or, all that got nerfed. You'd never play it now. Don't play it. Oh, it's the nerf versions. I know. Or I'm fully Sega. aware. <laughs> I'm just sad. Scav crane countermeasures, Vanguard, seems pretty good. And then it's got R five P eight on Nim. Uh huh. And no yeah, no genius. Yeah, I would hope he doesn't have R five P eight and genius. That would be well, great bounty vassal game. <laughs> Seems strong. Oh god, we're only halfway done with all this downtime. That's what I'm saying. We should watch a vassal game. We could play a vassal game and just leave it in the, and keep it going, and then pick it back up in between the next one. Let's let's do a. Let's make an alt format. Let's just do three. Do one, no, one, I think one, you guys one, should one. do fairship rebels versus fairship rebels, and you both. Just fortress. <laughs> yeah, no, and then after after 19 rounds, you guys can final salvo. Yes. I'll win that final salvo so hard. Actually, I've only ever won a final salvo once, and I've done like six, and I've been favored or tied in all of them. I remember the one at uh, Gen Con. So, oh. I, I won the one that counted. Everyone was like, Frank, come over and watch. <laughs> he was like, oh. He's like, am I watching? Oh, no, I don't want anything to do with this. <laughs> Like I'm curious to know, like you know, you, I've always thought like it'd be really interesting to just be a fly on the wall in their discussions and just seeing Frank and Alex and Max and Frank just be like, "Fine, you know, we need a solution. <laughs> just fine. What? Sure. Gunboat. Fine. I hate all of you. <laughs> I went to the bathroom and I came back and the gunboat got decided. What the hell? Yep. Ma what the hell, Max? <laughs> got him. All right, I'm joining this vassal game. What is it? The one I'm in. Yeah. yeah. I'm my synchronization's complete, like but I don't have a game board. Game, but... I guess I'll try syncing on someone. No, not send wake up. There we go. Join. You have the most latest updated thing on vassal. Yay! I don't. You're gonna have all this missing stuff, man. It'll be so sad. Start a game online. 
Final salvo me, Chris. <laughs> All right. Come at me, bro. I'll make a game. You guys can do 19 rounds in like a minute. No, join my game. It's better. What is it? Easy? <laughs> you really have to ask? <laughs> Who's player two? Somebody took player two? Really? No, no, no. I had, I had to start a new game. It's okay. Join another side. I'm going to be player one because I am the strong armor here, not the strong army. I'm player. All right, you ready? I'm player four. Right. Hold on. I'm not in. I'm not in the... I can't even roll 11 dice at once. What? I can roll seven and then do four more. Are we skipping right to the boss? Oh, no. All right, four. You got four? Yeah, it's gotta, you can't skip to the best of the good part. You got to go through all the hard work first. <laughs> through all the work. All right, here we go. Can you be you got to broadcast it? The oh no! One, All right, two, blanks. three, four, blanks, blanks. Seven plus four is eleven. Here we go. Got him. Oh, feels bad, man. Another final salvo. I'll add to my lost record. There you go. So another exciting game here. Uh, Gold Squad and Twitch. The viewers shirt. couldn't see. Oh, I forgot to you put up the dice tray. Oh, it doesn't count. Yep. Uh, Got to re replay. We're, we're, my dice. Oh, wait. It's right there. It is just buried. Actually, funny thing. It actually was there, guys. It just was underneath everything. So what you're saying is there's no proof except for the chat log. It doesn't count. <laughs> it's there. As a wise man once said, double or nothing. Double or nothing. All right, here we go. You can see the dice there, right, guys. This is final salvo. Here you ready? Fair ship on fair ship. Chris so goes here's first. seven. I'm rolling seven. All right, five. Good start. Six. Oh my god. All right. Your dice are so bad. <laughs> Six is above average. Rolling seven. Oh god. All right. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let's, uh, all of them. All of them. Let's go. Oh, Safe. Spe spend a focus. I'm fine. Wait. Hang on. <laughs> then I can do this. I'm going to cancel them. <laughs> <laughs> is this a scenario where you can complain about your dice? You know? <laughs> ah, my dice. <laughs> You see, what had happened was I was in a terrible position, and my dice didn't barrel me out. Yeah, your dice were bad. Yep. There's no way out of this situation other than your dice. Nope. <laughs> so, you know, I, I love love new players. Absolutely love new players. We we actually have a, a high schooler who started playing, and he's super enthusiastic, and it's awesome just to see him, you know, excited about the game. <laughs> and, you know, I'm, I'm trying, to, trying to teach him stuff as, as we play. And I ask him like, why? Why did you? Why did you do X? So he, he has a, an X seven defender. It has one hole left, and he three hards it through a rock to get a range one shot on my guy. So and he has no mods. And I have uh, what was I flying that day? Um, I think I had a full, a full shadow caster, the, like the the PS two one, the lowest one, the shadow port hunter, just kind of messing around. And uh, full health, and I'm go. So why why'd you go at him? It's like I'm just hoping for dice luck. I was like, but you have one ship, and my guy's full. What do you want to happen? I'm not. I mean, he needed he didn't do embrace variants because he was down, right? It's not what we recommend. I have a I have a, a, a similar fun anecdote for you. Go so for a it. guy brings his kid to come play, which is awesome. This kid's fun. Who's like I have no idea how old this kid is. Like. Nine or ten, probably. Yep. So every now and then I'll help him play some, and uh, he's a kid, so he loves, seriously loves rolling some dice. Oh yeah, for sure. But but he'll ask me like, hey, like how can I make my squad better? And it's like he'll have like fearlessness Finn Rao on the board because six dice. <laughs> Be like, well, you know, like having don't, don't dice. Don't tell him about advanced proton during this. Oh, you know, be like, you know, having dice with mods is better than having more dice. It's less fun, but it's better. And then he goes, all right, I'm going to try this and see how it goes. And then he starts yelling mid-game, and I go over and I walk over, and all I see is an actionless Finn Rao taking a shot at somebody range one and four crits and two hits on the table. It's like, all right, whatever. <laughs> Do whatever you want. <laughs> I did it. It's, it's gambling. It's fun. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, I mean, ca casual night. Are you trying to win or are you trying to have fun, right? Josh, did you really do this? Already? You can't give me this power. I don't deserve to be the one to post this. Also, it's not working. 
which is another down. Uh, your chat says, tell Chris the game ending is defined on page 7 of the Learn to Play document. The game ending is defined there. It's also defined in the tournament rules, and it's also defined in the rules reference. Wow. Okay. All right. Learning. <laughs> Who said who said we were experts? What is I I mean it is Sunterfell Magic Carpet Ride is the video, but I can't play the actual video. Internet internet's protecting me. That's what's happening right now. No, no. You can't no, do no, it. No. Oh hey, it's actually about to start again. So I'm hungry. But oh. it's like one in the morning and I don't have any food. Get a snack. Wake I don't wake, have any snacks. Wake Mary and be like, babe, <laughs> make me a scone. <laughs> Like one scone, not a batch, just one. How do you, how do you wake up a, a single scone? Up, uh, I just really need some thought. cookies. What you are you talking bad about my waifu? Maybe. Monster. I I believe Mary exists though. You believe? There's there's limited evidence, but the evidence does point. To I can't decide. Like she's existence. eventually just gonna wander into frame at some point, or like. Is she actually going to come to Mandalore? No, play? she's not going to come to Mandalore. Yeah. We played more games of L5R, and she's like, this is complicated, and I'm not having fun. And I was like, "That's I find this unsurprising. Let's do that. Somebody said, play this on Vassal. Play what? this on Vassal. <laughs> I triggered. Very triggered. Sink turret, ion bombs. Yeah, that's bad. Where's the R4 E1 or whatever to drop the bombs at the 4K? That's like you get. Is it unique? Missed yeah. opportunity. Synced turret ion. Oh, with title too. Yes, I'm super in. Because then you always get the rerolls. It's great. <laughs> you can't not get the rerolls. <laughs> All right. So so my plan is uh, to do like one more game. And if you guys if you guys are really feeling up to it and you guys are still awake, I will just leave the computer running and you guys do your thing. <laughs> I don't know if I'll have that much alive in me, but I mean it's only what, one? Two games would be like four? Yeah. You got like five hours till your bedtime, right? Uh something like that. Yeah. I got I got a sick baby. I gotta make sure I sleep a little bit so that she's Oh. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. She'd be she's tough. She'd be okay. So is it three rounds in so far? Yep, this is going to be yeah, we're round four. four. I assume it's so the, seven, six. The online thing seems very up to date then. That's pretty cool. Yeah, this, like, I don't know how, if this is like a super cryodex. I assume it's like a super cryodex. It looks better. It's all, it's on the, it's hosted on a website. So therefore it's better than cryodex is what I've learned. Yeah. So can you link me what you're looking at? Yeah, I'll put it in your chat. It's in your chat. Several it's times in your already. chat again now. I mean, sure. I just. Oh man, I was gonna call out the person that was in last place because you know, whatever. But the person in second to last place dropped, bought triple, brought triple punishers. So anyone that lost to them is either terrible or brought something even more wholesome. Oh, this is interesting. I've never seen this website before. So Jaren is three now. He had his buy. He got a hundred zero and a hundred twenty-eight wins. So. Looking pretty good for him. Also, I'd n like to note that there's another Paul Johnson at this tournament, and Paul Johnson gave me the single hardest time passing out the score sheets ever because I'd be like, Paul, and look up, and then it's not Paul Johnson, and it's also not Travis. <laughs> Extremely confused. Maybe they had a baby and named it Paul Johnson. I mean, it's possible. I think if... So, wait. Never mind. <laughs> I don't have a real response to that. You, you can't assume. Are you sure it's not the happen. same Paul Johnson as from Nova? Oh, I mean, if Paul, if it were Paul's kid, he would have sacrificed him to the dice gods long ago so they wouldn't survive to adulthood. I thought Paul Jr. was a striker. Yes, yeah, a super dead striker. <laughs> oh, hey, they, they reset the clock to 75 minutes. Maybe the thing's about to start back up. I uh, said there will be a slight delay on the next round starting. We no. apologize for the delay. Don't apologize. Yeah, people get mad when you apologize. I would like to note that I was playing Mario Odyssey, and I'm not now. You're welcome, Internet. Why? All right. Why what? 
you were currently playing Mario. Odyssey? I was before we before we started streaming. Ah, uh, were you having fun? I was, I was having a lot of fun. Yeah, enjoy that. I'm sure the inter- internet is very grateful, Chris. I sincerely doubt it. <laughs> All twenty viewers are really happy you're here. Twenty viewers today, a hundred viewers tomorrow. That's true. An infinite amount in the future. So, Travis lost the game. Sad. And Travis is running Miranda Dash. Like yeah. Mango. Mangler Dash. He hit Canyon Biggs. Oh, he that's got half right. of Canyon. Oof. Which that's is actually right. surprisingly winnable. Like, you know, like it, Dash is well, now the uh, one donut holding, which is hilarious. But I guess I was going to say with HLC, it seems better, but I guess it's different. Yeah. With HLC, super- you can kind of trade a range three, but you have to be like. Very careful. Well, yeah, the and, secret is you super can't because you don't even survive long enough to. Well, you can, like, toggle them in and out and trade. But, I mean, you have to play it perfectly and never have bigs in range, which is, like, yeah, probably it's impossible. Hard. I've never seen Dash beat Kanan Biggs in a tournament. I've and seen yeah, it all so the Mangler time in a game store. Be better, but it'd be so hard things. to consistently donut without taking the range one shots. So, yeah. yeah, that sounds pretty hard. Feels bad, man. Bad feels. Luckily, it won't be around much longer. But oh, Chris, lower- I have, I have graham crackers on my desk. Oh, thanks for rubbing it in. <laughs> <laughs> I just got really Since excited. There are no other Chris. Oh, oh, graham crackers. <gasps> yes, here it is. All right, I am uploading a video to the Carolina Crates YouTube video. You should be really excited or to the YouTube channel. Chris, do you eat organic food? I eat whatever Mary prepares does she yes. does she prepare organic food so kind of so she was on like a clean eating thing for a while because all the ingredients were super cheap because it was like a fad yeah but then it kind of died off so now it's all expensive again so we're not doing that so it's not like organic but she like prefers to make stuff without lots of preservatives and things yeah so i don't know i don't know how's that for an answer that's cool. Good one, right? That, I mean, Are you starting your crazy workout stuff soon, Chris? No. Oh. <laughs> I, I had to stop doing that first. You to, like get jacked or something. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'll get there eventually. One day. One day. All right. Hang on. I'm sorry. I'm distracted by uploading this video, and then I'll have it's fine answers to things I'll tell, like I'll, I'll really, tell you my really way. important questions like. Why aren't you jacked? Well, I'm not jacked because I really, really like cookies. Like I'm a that really, is really the big, best answer. Really big fan of cookies and milk and cake, and chocolate muffins and cupcake. Oh my god, but I'm I I big big goods are my kryptonite, mm-hmm. and like so um I, I I think I've told you guys like so I own a two flat and my mom lives on the first floor and takes care of my daughter. So, um, so before she came, like I was, I mean, I was not fit by any means, but I was trying to eat a little bit better. And, you know, I, I had my own agency, right? My wife was like, we're going to have salads every day. I was like, great. Excellent. This is fine, right? So Wait, we're eating salad. Did you have agency? It doesn't sound like your wife gave you an agency. But, no, but th- this is fine. Like I, I accepted it. Like I, okay. it was my choice. But you still didn't have any say in it. it just, <laughs> you just liked how it worked out. They they had their bump master, and she just sucked at playing it. Right. Okay. So <laughs> sure. But then my mother moved in, and then she'll cook on random days. Like at first, I was like, "Hey, mom, can you like let me know? Like, hey, how about you cook a little extra on like Tuesdays and Thursdays? That way, I know to expect it." But no, she's like, "I don't want that pressure. I'll just do it when I want." I'm like, "Oh, okay." So. My wife would be like, all right, I made a salad. And my mom's like, I got this super delicious Puerto Rican food. Do you want this instead? And I was like, ah, uh, both? <laughs> <laughs> like, I, I come home before my wife. So I was like, all right, I'll eat a little bit of this then. Yeah, I've gained like 30, 30 pounds since my mom. 30 delicious, delicious pounds. Yeah. I need I need to slim down before Worlds so I can I can fit in my, my, uh, my Gold Squadron bikini. Sounds like your mom's taking good care of you. Yep. It's like, Mom. Dude. Oh, man. Are you guys ready for how much Reddit karma I'm about to get? All totally earned. 
<laughs> Are you going to be the one who posts it? Apparently. Because I have the raw video that just finished getting uploaded. Oh, no. You're really not going to put that on Reddit, are you? Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm not going to put it on Reddit. I already did. <laughs> death death revived. I can see him already. Fuck Dion. I shouldn't say that. He's actually a cool guy. Hey, he's one of the Canadian guys, right? Yeah. Submit your post to Reddit. There we go. Okay. <laughs> oh, I see it. Submitted just now by Bruno. It would be against the terms of service for me to suggest that you go upvote that. But I can say that if you go to the X Wing TMG, hit new, the first thing on there is super awesome. <laughs> Oh, you got the picture from the thing, too. I know. Josh, like, nailed it out of the park. All I had to do was upload it. Oh, no. There's, there's, okay. It does show up in the video. Yeah, yeah. It's like the first half second doesn't have it. I was going to fix it and then decided no one cared. Lies. I don't see it. But I do. It's amazing. It's beautiful. I'm just missing it, huh? Oh, Dion's rendition of Magic Suter. <laughs> Let's relive this. I'll, I'll sing it. I'll, I'll sing it in my my low sultry voice. Oh, you put a video. <laughs> I love that picture. <laughs> I didn't do it. Shout out, Josh. Josh, what's your username <clears throat> so I can like tag you in this? I need my lemon water. Thank you. I need a change of pants. I don't know why you didn't just upload it. Oh, I'm glad it has the music because I didn't hear that when you we did it. Where this lyrics? Shimmering splendid. Hey, wait, Lyle's Lyle. awake. Lyle. Well, I mean, he's 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 on he's a West Coaster too. Yeah. Oh. How is this gonna come back and bite me? Is my name in this YouTube video? No, it's not on the YouTube video. Okay, that's fine. I can't edit the post title. It's too late. The internet knows. My my students Google me all the time. It's uh -huh. it's a little ridiculous. It's a, it's not like you have a really rare name like uh, Dion. <laughs> <laughs> you can't be the only Dion though. You'll be fine. Unless they know to scour the X Wing TMG Reddit for you specifically. I or have so I have like four students who are really internet savvy. And they, they, you know, like one of them specifically last year uh, told me to get good several times, um, which was interesting. And I was like, and this was like when Chris started his thing. And I, I looked at him and was like, wait, did you just, do I believe you? Do you know what you're saying? And he did. I did. Yeah. Fully aware. Yeah, so that was interesting. It's not mean if it's disrespectful on purpose, is what I've been told. I'm going to go with that. Right. Yeah, but see, see but you've got two very nice comments in that already. You've got a nice voice, and what a sultry voice. <laughs> and neither of those are Chris. And ne neither of them are me. Hmm. All right, Carolina Crates Community Paste. <laughs> oh, jeez. Not the Facebook. <laughs> That's a closed group, right? Please. Yeah. It's a closed group. Okay, good. <laughs> it's not like there's like 400 people in it. And anyway, God, my <laughs> YouTube suggested videos. Jesus. Where'd it go? Magic suit here ride. There it is. New. Oh, look at this cool video. Okay. Oh, by the way, I recorded uh, three of those uh, videos we were talking about on Wednesday. Oh, cool. I still need to do them this week for me because I forgot my laptop this yeah. week. I might. Oh, <gasps> oh, here we go. It's happening. Action. Whoa, look at those templates on the left. Who could this be that we're spectating? Ooh. Not even in Australia are you safe, Dio. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> You know, <laughs> excuse me. Uh, no. 
I like how you guys make it sound like I've been tabled like a bajillion times. <laughs> yeah, you have like a bajillion. Like once. I mean, Ricky still has the record, right? No, it's a, it's a sling paint, guys, isn't it? Well, uh, they got disqualified, so they don't count. Yeah, so three was the record, and it was done in one day. And I was like, I'm off, I'm off this ride. This is a <laughs> one-way train to bankruptcy. So who holds the most table? Oh, Duncan, easily. Not even close. I own like seven sets of templates. Oh, I meant the other way around. Oh, gotcha. Not the good way. <laughs> I think it's Ricky. I still have to send them his box of them. I've been putting it off because I need to order like one more set. He didn't get tabled at Evergreen though. So. <laughs> That's I, I was so proud of him. It, which who do I? Oh, is it, it might be Actar on stream. On the right, we got one of the Renegade guys. So we got Dengar. Well, one of them had Miranda Dash. Or... Surprise. Jump Master. We... Yeah, we have Jump Master with the Tani. Triple old Jump Master, sir. Well, that's. But. You Sounds guys like are Mind Link on two of them. Not today. Wait, they have Torps too? I didn't know they had a Torps slot. Not today. Now, he didn't hole punch him, so it's fine. Oh. He, like, snuck past the door when yep. they were doing that? Yep. <laughs> Actually, how cool is it that these templates we made as a joke made their way to Australia? I can't believe that. That's super awesome. That's pretty sweet. It's brilliant uh, advertising for you guys. You're on, like, more... More of the templates are great templates than any other template on video or X-Wing. That's true, because good players have them. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it was int interesting, you know, uh, just uh, introspective, you know. Growing up, I was always told by my parents, like, you'll always go farther when you respect people and all this, <laughs> right? And I was like, all right, so that's what I'm going I'm to try to live my life and do my things. And then I look over to my left <laughs> Say, you know what? Find a podcaster, make them feel horrible, get a picture of them, free advertising. I'm like, oh god, that's genius. <laughs> that's how the world works, Dion. Right. And, th and then, nice guys finish last. And then, and then the world, right? The world looks at me and say, no, you can't. You can't all of a sudden become disrespectful because then you're you're a lie, right? Then I'm lying to people. Well, I mean, we need some contrast for the crates, right? Like, someone's got to be wholesome. Right. <laughs> That's true. Sad. Some, I don't want to be wholesome every day. Like, I have my bad That's days, That's what you guys. get. I have the my best bad part days. is, you can, I mean, if if your whole thing is that no one should ever take you seriously, you, you can be, like, bipolar in how you respond to things. It's fantastic. It's very true. I'm like, so it's like a really good list here. You seeing this? Three Boba Fett's. That, oh, that's a good strategy. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Paul would be so proud. And so would Sue. And he's got a four point bid. If he yes. wins, does he get a crate down in here? I, I mean, I don't know. God, like... actually, off topic while I'm thinking about it, when he won that, I was like, oh, God, what do I do? Because he was like yeah. one of our first crate bounties. He tabled one of the, uh, what's it called? Imperial Propaganda Radio guys. Oh yeah, hell of a pilot. Or... No, no, like the it's a Australian podcast called Imperial Propaganda Radio. Oh, okay. They There's haven't another... put one out in a bit. Um, but oh my god, I was like, I don't know how to get templates to Australia. Shipping is like a hundred and twenty dollars for any reasonable time frame, and then uh, if I want to do it by just like USPS, it'll take like four months and probably never like, make it. To Travis. At yeah, that's what I did. I gave him to, I gave him to the Fosses at Worlds. We played a game of, like, telephone with templates. It was quite silly. I was glad that they made it, though. Because that was faster than the post was going to be, was to just give it to them at Worlds. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. I ship a lot of things. I have a couple guys in uh, in Australia. And yep. I, I have to I have to do it through USPS. There's no there's no other cost-effective way to do it. Oh, yeah. And it's still, like, 10 bucks or something. Yeah. You just you, you put it in the box, and you hope. Uh, Darth Nacho wants to know if he gets a set of templates for getting me to sing. Um, no. There you go. You didn't table me. 
good, good try, try, good try. Yeah, like, you know, it never hurts to ask. I mean, he got me to do things that I like to do. I like singing. Singing's fun. Oh, hey, now we're back to... They're having fun with the overlay. No, we lost all our copies of Boba Fett. Just chips. All th- this list got a whole lot worse. Did. Uh, it's a lot of torps I see on these jump masters. I am so glad. Dash versus triple jumps. I know how my this money's, is. My money's on the jumps, but I mean, <laughs> yeah. it's it's possible. Oh, it's a it's not Miranda. a buy, but it's pretty close to a buy. I actually like Miss Miranda less here. I don't know. Which oh, conch missiles instead of cluster mines. Yeah, I'm not oh, a big fan. That cargo shoot. That rig cargo shoot is not going to help. Pro tip. That dash is never clearing maneuver after like the first couple turns. It's just not I mean, if he tries to get it off, yeah, he's gonna get blocks. But are there a lot of infill agents here? I'm not sure. I hope so. We don't know. Come on. We don't Actor, know. Anything. I believe in you. The Fosta spoke so highly of you. Yeah, I would guess he has like Boba and two Intel. It sounds hard for the or, course. Like, Boba, Sicatro, Intel or something. At least one. All you need is one for Miranda Dash. But yep. two is you know, three is great. Extra disrespect. Make them flip one twice. They love yeah, it. Yeah, the cargo shoot on the Intel scout from Miranda. That'd be really nice, too. Yeah. Pro Express, I on Miranda is so sad. I have had a guy um, when I was running triple jump masters. Like, he flipped the dial quickly and flipped it back over. And I was like, I'm like, well, I didn't get to see it, so I guess I have my second Intel. Can you flip it again? <laughs> 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 it was great. Or when you Intel agent them when they're moving before you. Fantastic. Yes. I'd like to see it, please. Thank you. Okay, I, get, I need to I, see it again. I guess. Right, I need to see it a third time. Okay, you're good. <laughs> now move. <laughs> looks like uh looks like he's having some trouble with the overlay. I understand, man. I you it looks like he's having an X uh XWS format issue. Um, oh it yeah. But No, nothing ever goes wrong when you're trying to live stream an event like on crazy Wi Fi with a computer that you can't make changes to. Yep. Yeah, and he's using he's using the uh, the tabletop um, overlay, which is great, but it's also internet based, and that's yep. it's good. But at the same time, he's using a lot of bandwidth to to get that stuff done. So weird stuff happens. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's just a browser, and then you overlay the mm-hmm. sides over it. That makes sense. I need to figure out how to do that. Yeah. That's a tough matchup for the scouts. Believe it or not, I don't, Lyle. I don't believe you. I've watched this game happen many times. I mean, it's not unwinnable for Miranda Dash, but if the scout player is good, I think he wins like very high percentage of the time. But like Dash Miranda, especially with the missile, can almost one round of scout. So that's the only thing he has going for him. Oh, he is listening to us. Okay, never mind. And then my three copies of Boba Fett joke is not funny because I already said it. Oh, well, whatever. It's fine. <laughs> Yeah, why is Susan talking in the wrong chat? Or, like, everyone's talking in the wrong chat? I, w- I mean, I don't know. I like us. the people who are talking in the other chat, because... Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Like, not everyone's listening to us. That's fine. Yeah. I thought it needed to be a real podcast for the bounty. I mean, nothing outside of the U.S. is real, so we can kind of count it. Is that the only non-U.S. podcast that we've... I think that's the only non-U.S. podcast that's been bountied. Maybe so foreigners what? just don't listen to crates because we've insulted them so many times. Pro- no, or, they definitely do because they're still mad. <laughs> Especially the Delapinans. They, they really want to prove that they are good. So Dash has this nice little L of rocks there. That's his safe place. But the problem is that Khan knows that that's a safe place. So, just play around it. I do like that Miranda Dash is bringing big rocks instead of debris. The lazy option. There's yeah. cool stuff you do with Dash and rocks if you're like good at the game, which I assume Ben is good because I recognize that name, right? Ben Doyle. Let's see. Hey, Lyle, you won't give me a search function on List Juggler, but Google will do it for me, so nothing matters. I assume that he does that on purpose to not let you like scout out an opponent really easily or something yeah but i can go ben doyle site list uh, Clubhouse.com and all right sorry bing i don't want to <laughs> let's see you're gonna bing it 
Yeah, bing it. All right, so we got... Uh, he was... Oh, he won... Wait. Oh, he won Australian Nationals last year. That's a pretty good showing, I yep. guess. <laughs> all right, what else are we you, got? Are you concerned about the spread out jumps at all? I'm not sure I like it. No, Here, it's, is this it's fine. Course? You have you have a lot of space. You got a lot of I space. I mean, you're going to converge. The only problem is if you... If... Uh, the dash player is able to take advantage of it. Like training with one scout is very favorable for him. So, so yes, right. he is the reigning Australian national champion. He's probably pretty good at this game. Yeah. So, so then we'll probably have a really interesting game. Taking a long range scanners on the uh, bottom jump there. At least I think he gave, he gave a, a very uh, commanding point at that jump master. So yeah, it looks like Ben might be able to missile this scout and engage Dash on the far scout, and that's kind of what I'm worried about with the spread out scouts. Like, Miranda is definitely going to take a lot of damage here, but if he can, like, trade a scout for Miranda, that's probably really good for him. Like, Dash can probably clean that up. No, I don't believe you. I mean, I mean, I would, not... I would, one scout for Miranda, I do it every day. Uh, I mean, it depends on like if there's like two missiles left. I think Dash is still fine. Like if Dash is at full, like I yeah. think. Well, I mean, it depends on the scout position too. Because if you've got one in front of him, then the game's over. But True. if you don't, then it's not. Is that a start? Star Killer Base destroying planets map. Is that what that's supposed to be? So this jump can't block Miranda if she doesn't want straight. You could get the range one, but. <laughs> I might get kicked out of this chat. Sorry. What are you what are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not doing anything open. in the chat. It's fine, Dio. Don't worry about it. What are you doing? Just, just spamming USA. Don't. It's fine. <laughs> you know, sometimes you know, get get a little cheesy here. Sometimes I, I I had to stop and think and be like, this is kind of amazing, right? We're watching people play in Australia, talking about it on three different sides. You know, literally spread out across the United States and broadcasting all over the world. It's crazy. I yeah, I don't know. Had one of those moments. <laughs> Chris, like, whatever, I guess. I guess it's cool. No, I was going to agree, and then I didn't have anything good to follow it up with. So now I guess <laughs> I just make fun of you, I think, is the right yeah. option. <laughs> what a cheesy nerd. Yeah, that's fine. That's who I am. I know who I am. Oh, look at those templates. They're so beautiful. Why is it upside down? The Actor, that's disrespect. Please. Gang culture uh, says that that is just disrespect. And, uh, so he is not going to let Miranda get a missile off on him. He can take... Could arrange one shot on him, but he doesn't really care about that. Yeah, I'm and, super in for And being in front of shots. Miranda is where you want to be. Oh, but Miranda. Miranda, no. Look at I that don't know who play. has uh, intel or anything like that or shoots or anything. Yeah, I assume his plan is to just take Dash to Black City with that guy over there yep. and then kill Miranda with these guys. I don't think that's going to be possible, though. I, I mean, if Dash does like a hard turn or something, you're not going to get in front. Like, I mean, if Ben Doyle is good, he's not going to let that jump get in front of Dash. We have we have to figure out. Uh, I'll ask. <laughs> is this guy good? Is he good? Who the? Well, I mean, player? like he might not have a choice later. Later, but like the one on one here, he's got those rocks there, so he can turn and be fine. Right. And Miranda's gonna have unless Miranda did like the two bank right which might be on a rock then he's got the hilarious like slam cluster mines right at the intro which would be hilarious he doesn't have cluster mines though. He has oh cluster you're oh my god he doesn't have cluster like mines. which i really disagree with for his list building well are you the australian national champ i'm not not today i mean maybe maybe you thought it was a good medical here I, my friend's been playing with missile miranda dash for a while and he really likes it so do you slam into this jump master if you that could. was a one straight, so you can't, or it's yeah. super close. He could, he could one bank slam into it, no problem. And No, I don't think it's worth it, because you still can get blocked by the next guy next turn, so you're not really... Yeah, well, you're, but you, you're avoid, you avoid a shot, though. Yeah. But, I mean, you'll take, a what, three damage here? So one scout has intel. I'm going to assume 
That that is the front one. I hope. All right, takes a shield. Burn a shield or no balls, Miranda. You already chose not to do that, I guess. Whoa! The dice overlay thing is cool, but the players are having some serious trouble. <laughs> not sure. Is this Dasher's shot, or did that already happen? Looks like it was four dice, so I assume it was Dash. You got a lot of blanks. Yeah, no, there it is. It looks like they gave up on the dice tray. They know what they did. We okay, broke so it. Four, four into the scout. So that, like, Dash can kill a scout in three turns. And it's like very scary turn, though. Like that scout can just one straight, and Dash is like super scared. No, Dash is hard turning away next turn. Like the the scout's not getting in front of him. No, no, I'm saying just one straight target lock. Dash sure. I mean, straight. I'll take a missile on Dash with Lone Wolf. I mean, I'll take three shields. Yeah, you tops. take three shields. It's hard to for it to not be like exactly three shields. Like it's it's not a great trade, but they don't even have to target lock. It's not how this game works. It's not how Atani works. Just do whatever you want. So Miranda's getting trashed. Just one shield. Really? He rolled the natty. I missed it. Yep. That looks like two hits. Get a target lock. Actually, wait. Are there actually proton torpedoes on all these or just the one? I think it's just the one. Oh, Miranda get good. So Miranda eats three shields. Then I think that guy yet hasn't shot dash yet. Yeah, like... With Dash, I one heart away, or maybe two heart if it's on the rock. Uh, Miranda. Miranda's in a bad spot. Yeah. And assuming there's intel involved here, like, it's very unlikely he's going to clear a maneuver. Because that's just. Cool. The front scout, like, one hearts and possibly girls back, necessarily. The other guy's coming up behind to block any longer moves from Miranda. Andrew, there's no way that Jump Master could one turn and block all of Miranda's dial. That would be obscene. Uh, I mean, she could too hard away. <laughs> <laughs> to the board, it's very strong. She still has some agency. The the she... three bank, right, or like towards the board edge might clear as well. Uh, yeah, that would clear. Not but, in an ideal position. I don't know. If I'm this jump master, I probably... I don't know. It depends on which one has intel and everything. If I had, if I had shoot, I would be really happy with that jump's position. Cause yeah. You can yeah, that... and shoot. The one or two turn shoot is just super savage. <laughs> it's just such a sad Miranda. Yeah, I mean, you one hard, maybe barrel up back if you want to block something, or just sit there. The other guy can either set up a torp if the front guy blocks, or you can block any three maneuver that Miranda tries to do. Because you can't, you can't let Miranda clear like a three and try to slam away because that's like he's only out here. No, that'd be a bad. That'd be bad. But yeah, I don't see how Miranda's going to come out ahead against these two jumps. So, like, all Ben can hope for is that Dash, like, takes out this far scout as quickly as possible. But, and, like, maybe he only gets three symbols or uh, three hits from the plasma and Dash only takes two. Like, things like that. And if um, Khan has to blow more missiles to kill Miranda, then, like, missiles are the only way that Dash is going to take damage unless he goes to Black City later. So it's still very doable for Ben, possibly, but it's not looking good. Yeah, that Miranda should be real scared. Like, super scared. She might just die this turn. If that Boba Scout is the one with the target lock, she's probably just going to wow. die this turn. But Jesus. So do we get confirmation on what the list actually is? Is it really... Do they all really have protons? No. He just can't update it. If they um, had all protons, that'd be really good for Dash. No, it's uh, one is so one is the one that's listed there. They all have R four. They all have Tani. Shockingly, one has Intel Agent. I assume the other is the Sicatro rig cargo shoot. Okay, cool. Or whatever slicers or you know well, some one point thing. Right. Whatever. They're all the good. same. Yeah. I actually rig cargo shoot because that's the only one you would ever use. Um. Yeah. But just in case, you never know. You never know. <laughs> okay. If if you're playing against Dash in a bid. Then the cargo shoot's not going to help you. So there. That's true. So it looks like we're waiting on that middle jump master dial. He's deciding 
So, all right, strategy tip. Don't do this. Don't set down two of your three dials and let your opponent know which dial it is you're thinking about. <laughs> Hold all your dials. Put them all down at once. I learned that from Blair. He always puts down all his dials at once. Yep. That's the way to it's do very it. Intim- it's very good intimidation factor, too. <laughs> so there's the one heart. Is there? Oh, that cargo shoot is so savage if it's there. I guess that's not the one with he, Intel Agent. He didn't Intel. Oh, well, so... Yeah, you just shoot because uh, it might not get the double because oh. I'm not sh- it's like super close to hitting him right now, but because it's just a little bit wider than the base. But based on uh, the warp, that must be it, not the one with the shoot. It, yeah. Oh, so sad. So if so, he didn't intel. Oh, if he even has one so, with the shoot. And like Ben knew that he didn't have intel, so he could actually try to have, like use some agency here, and he could do the two hard. Uh, but he would have to guess that he does that barrel back, which I think he probably didn't guess. Oh, I really like that bank with the jump, because if Dash, if Dash does do that one turn, he's got a barrel roll and just hang out in front of you with no actions, which feels pretty bad, man. Forward one, I'm thinking here. Yeah. Yep. You can't just block yourself. You won't get actions. There's no way you'd already have focus target lock. <laughs> Wait, you're saying if Dash does the hard one or two, what's bad about that? He has to barrel in order to get the shot? He has to, to barrel roll to not be on the rock. Is what it, well, to not be range one, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I don't know if he has ray tokens saved up because he only got the one. Yeah, I don't think he does. So he still has to barrel roll here I'm with the four straight. He has one ray token. Because yeah, he probably has can. one. Uh, I don't know. Can. Hmm. Yeah, there's the barrel roll. He's going to try at least. I really worst don't. Case, Say that you work. turn off your ability. Say it. I really disagree with this move. I think the hard turn would have put him in a better position. Because now he's faced, like, the jump hey. on the right is facing. Finn, I like the way you think. I don't know if that three-bank right slam fits, though. We don't know where the board edge is yeah. here. Can't tell. Hope. Balls? No, the, it does the rock not is fit. Too, too, so, yeah, I doubt it. So, it looks like it might be still range two. Yeah, it's definitely range two. We so can at least regen TLT, but he's gonna get plasma or or, or proton. Both. Oh, yeah. blanks the first one. Sad. It's fine. You weren't gonna do any relevant damage here, anyways. Yeah. And you know Miranda's gonna get too hard next turn. You don't even need intel for that. So you can block her if you want. Yeah, or you could not if you want to not. Whatever. You can just sloop and do it again. Use the bomb. Don't he care. One, he can go one bank if he's trying to be tricksy. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> There's a dimensional rift. So I guess, yeah, the only reason he did that dash move as opposed to the turn was to not take the torp. Um, yeah. But now dash is kind of setting himself to go up to go to Black City. Like, yeah, really that's, be. I mean, because you can run away, but then you're in open territory, and then you're going to get cornered. So, like, rather than being able to use those rocks, like, the jump masters, they're kind of pushing away from the rocks. Yeah. Well, I mean, he can, like, two turn right next turn, and then if actor goes if, for the if block, the jump doesn't really do, sad. like, a three straight or something, or four straight to lock it. Yeah. yeah he's uh, the jump master on the bottom pointing that way is, is, is in a great spot. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I mean, Con. John's in a great spot overall. Dash does some. Oh, natties! Don't care. <laughs> and bring That's Dyson, not roll natties. Where's their guy who uses the dice app? That's the real question. Does everyone have a guy? Really? Sabine? Oh, never mind. I thought we were saying we were going to Boba Fett Sabine here. I was like, I don't believe you. <laughs> we're going to Boba Fett that TLT all day if Everybody. it's an option. It's gone. It's straight out the back. Kick it. I mean, she's going to have like one hell left. One hell yeah. left so. Oh, hey, there's a three symbols and one that doesn't matter. Uh, it might matter if... No, you can just... Is it yeah, the, it has to be is a, a range one shot? Forgetting the... Oh. I don't know. I couldn't tell. It was... Ooh, the range one shot put three damage in? That's so savage. There's a hit. I can't tell what's happening. You rolled an evade at some point in time. Something happened. Miranda might be dead or mostly dead. 
think she's dead. Oh, yeah, she's dead. Hey, the game's over. All See right. you, Ben. G- was a good I mean, <laughs> it's not looking good. No, nope, I mean, it's not completely over, but yeah, like you should be able to corral Dash at this point, get a jump in front, and then he's going to die. Dash can deal with two if he's got a bunch of Ray tokens stacked up, but I don't think he's is, got it. He don't, I think he's got one maybe at some point. He doesn't have a lot of tokens, and they have a lot of torps left. And, and he didn't even do that much damage. And, and Ector is in a great spot um, to, within the next two turns, just have, have Dash perma blocked. I mean, he's not going to be able to go anywhere. Yeah, if I were jumps here, I'd try to block a hard turn into the rocks from Dash and force him out into the open. Yep. Um, and then maybe sloop this other one to start coming around, the, one, the other one at the bottom. Mm-hmm. Um, maybe a hard turn barrel roll from the guy at the top. Or sloop. Yeah, I think the sloop. I don't think the hard turn fits. But again, weird angles. Yeah, it's hard. Man, the uh, actual stream chat is salty about nothing matters. None of this matters. It still matters. People put a lot of like time and work into getting their list ready and everything. It's good that they didn't change the rules on them last second. Yep. Like just because you can't use the this meta knowledge to like further your thing doesn't make it not really interesting. Like the decision making and everything's still good to watch and make sure that you know what's going on. But we don't want to learn, Chris. <laughs> we don't want to learn. We just want to roll natties. Yeah. I just I I brought a book at a dice and I want to roll them. It's true. Or it I brought feels munitions. bad to lose the things that you know are getting nerfed, right? But I mean, at the it national does. level, like. You're, you know, I mean, you know, you have to play the best stuff to win. So everyone's on the same table. Well, and, same and if play. if a jump master wins, right, with with munitions, it goes, hey, it, it's a little bit of uh, confirmation. It's like, oh look, I I think we did make the right choice after X amount of, uh, you know, He's gonna God, dash. Nerf. Good luck. Good I mean, luck. Dash, dash Dash has a hard turn into the rocks. But I mean, he might have expected the block, so he might have not done it. Yeah. Um, but so I mean, if if he does do that turn, he's in a much better spot because then no jump is getting in front of him anytime soon. He's kind of corralled himself to the board. Like either both ways seem bad. He's corralled himself to the board edge either way. Like I realize, like I'm not saying he made a mistake to get there, but trying to escape three intel jumps from like blocking a donut holding you is just an impossible task. Yep. And all of them have target locks. Uh, because maybe yeah. not that guy on the outside, but um, the two that can torp him have him there. This is you can still trade effectively with like one jump. Um, I don't know. Yeah, it's just the it's so many like even the, just the two die turrets start to catch up with you. Well, that's where Lone Wolf really adds up, but and the two yeah. dice. But he doesn't have the ray tokens. That's the part that's really gonna hurt. Oh, but you know what he does have? He's got countermeasures, guys. So that does help. He's got. He's got. He's got a. Uh, I mean, turnout. it is relevant. Yeah. He can just tank one torp because it he won't didn't happen. Didn't even have once. to run Lebo to get countermeasures. Is that? <laughs> is that legal? Someone should ask the UK players. Yeah. But so he, he expected the block, so that's why he's going into the open here. Having trouble with the template because it's right on the rock. Yeah. So, but I mean, now that we realize he has countermeasures because we can read lists, this is actually isn't too bad because he can just pop that one target lock. And, but I think that's the unhurt jump master is the problem. Uh, yeah, that guy's not hurt. Yeah, but that's that's fine. Like, it's a good trade here. You've got. HLC against the two die turret essentially because yep. you pop that. But man, it's gonna get ugly so quickly when all these jump masters one straight and the bottom yeah. guy three banks. Yep, because you're gonna corral him into that top top left corner. And then he's never getting out. Yeah. Unless I mean, like Khan could make a mistake. And yeah. I mean, or gonna, like kind of, these jump masters so, could just blank a lot and just die in two shots. Like it's possible. Right. It happens. Like, I've played He's, scouts against Dash a lot. I mean, not triple scouts, but just one, and it, it melts so fast. So he's debating whether or not to pop those countermeasures right now. I mean, I think the time is probably nigh. Yeah, I agree. There it is. Yeah. I mean, you want to use countermeasures if you're taking multiple shots to take advantage of the agility, too, but 
it's Peter, hard I think for you to just get ahead. Like, yeah. That's why you don't take any real damage on dash, and you get in more damage. You probably don't even need the focus for defense. You can spend with reckless Jeez. abandon on offense. I'm not sure I agreed with his choice to shoot the jump master near Miranda last turn. If he had the shot on the other guy, because the other guy had already taken more damage, and he could have had that one super low. Prophecy. Two blanks on defense. Chris has seen it. I know what's up. He will make it so. I forgot the yell, save me, Duncan. He did. It's a rookie mistake. It happens. It's understandable, but... Oh! Seems good. Dash, three natties. Oh, wow. Got wow. His, got Dash, get it, it together. Yeah, every focus spend hurts so much, though. Yeah, all right, so th did he have range for that torpedo, or was it just out? Just, the other guy was out. Just out, all yeah. right. Um, oh, yeah, he reacquired the target line, okay. Yep. Yep, because R4. So, yes, one forward, one forward, three bank. That's that's the move. I don't think... It feels really bad that he doesn't have um, any rate token saved up. One thing... I wouldn't mind doing here is doing like a three hard towards the jump at the top with dash or something to try to get a like try to block your, that or yeah you'd rather eat it. the range one shot than the torp as stupid as it is and, and you can get past him after that because he can't well depending on if he has intel or not and depending on the positioning you might you might not be able to block a move if he's at a certain angle or something Because if he goes to that corner, he knows he's not getting out. I mean, his only out right now is is going to the right. Like that's it. He did, you can't you can't go straight. You can't go deeper into the corner. Actually, yeah, I really like maybe like a one hard barrel, but it's, and the problem is he doesn't have the focus because then you might be able to get around that jump. But it's it's so unlikely, especially if the jump go, does a safe like one forward, then it's going to be really hard to get around him if he has intel. So I was catching up on some other things. You guys are saying better for Dash to YOLO to the board edge, turn into the top jump master, or try to bail to the left and hope to dodge jump masters turning the wrong way? Turn to the right. I think that's his only actual out. What about the 4K or no balls? Um, Probably lands on the rock. So, so the biggest, the biggest problem with the turn to the right is shoot. the one forward from that jump is neutral enough that you're not going to get past him probably. Yeah. But if he like overcommits with a fast move, then the turn. Right. I mean, better. you kind of have to hope your opponent just makes mistakes, right? At this point, like he, yeah, you can't play around them being or, or roll playing optimally. Those are your two strategies. <laughs> Fair. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if Dash just tries to do like. Oh, he did come in aggressive. Okay. So, you know, so yeah, like if. But that if, means if that one turn happens, now Dash is blocked. It looks like. But that's but not if, that if bad. He did something, plus, if he did like a two bank barrel roll, though. I mean, getting blocked, you're eating the torp, and you're not gonna have a focus because I don't think he has ray token. So it's kind of bad, but he might be able to get past him next turn if that jump has, doesn't have intel, or if the angles work out so he can't block everything on Dash's style. Yeah. So it might be worth it to take the one torp here. That just feels bad. <laughs> worth, worth, <laughs> worth it, worth it to take a torp. <laughs> feels I mean, bad, man. Yeah, if there's two, the three two, bank. You could only take three shields. Yep. Take a target lock. Lock it up. Yep. There it is. You already have the target lock, right? He went, did the expected move. Probably yeah, the, not, the pro. Huh, but it doesn't. Well, matters a little bit. Uh, it looks like he's fine. <laughs> well, now, he's, now who knows? <laughs> Nothing matters. <laughs> so, yeah, the, the one thing about on the this back move is probably too far out. Yeah. That jump can't really block anything. You can only stay there in order to block the dash. So, dash does the three bank. Or a straight and gets away, which is the best thing for Ben here. 
if he comes out of this turn without taking too much. So I think he just rolled two more blanks. That's what the audio sounded like. Yeah, three more go into that scout. That's good for Ben. That's actually yeah, really that's good. what he needs. Yeah. Uh, that torp looks in. Oh, that's, that's it. not good. That's <laughs> that's no, not. I didn't expect that. It's a bummer. Yeah, the angle is throwing us off there. I don't know how the boba proton situation is, but uh, if that's still on the table. Oof. All right. Three hits and a crit. If you boba off the the heavy laser cannons, it's over real quick. Yeah. So three shields. Oh, maybe that was out of range, and the ruler's just extra weird to look at at this angle. Okay. Because, yeah, that was a proton. So, he didn't take, he only took like two or three shields that turn. Yeah, took two shields. Okay, so that could, was, could have been worse. That was, yeah, that was a great trade for him. I mean, he traded those three shields for position here. Yeah. Because he could have, like, went into the corner and maybe had a better turn, but, like, then he yeah. screwed. Well, and, yeah, now that scout has to leave. And that force rate, like, was a mistake. In my opinion, from actor, he came in too, so one, too aggressive because it's now, like you, like you said earlier, like he has less options now. Right. Because you don't like if you're facing dash like this, and it can be really hard to get that block the next turn. Like, but if you're in, if you're back where you did the one straight, now you guarantee the block, and you're blocking him like with a hard turn or something, and then it's much easier to stay in front of him. True. Um, From here, you could hard turn and barrel back, but I mean, if Dash is going to three bank or three straight or four straight, and he's going to get past him. Yeah. Well, I mean, the jump moves are pretty easy this turn. Like, you can just loop the top guy. Mm -hmm. You can two turn the damage scout away and just try to get range from Dash, try to get out of range. And, and it's then, just your focus battery now. Yeah. And then use one turn the other scout to come up the rear. But, but it, it does mean so you're chasing Dash, wonderful. which is what you want. And we don't. So. What's the torp situation? Like, the injured guy, I guess he doesn't really matter. But the other two have how many torps left? Uh, should be one, two on the top guy, and then one on the bottom one. Mm -hmm. I think. There might be one of those might be one. There might be a missing copy of extra munitions. But he hasn't been intel agenting or anything all game, so I assume there's just a lot of extra munis. Mm -hmm. But yeah, like... Dash isn't getting torped from the top jump this turn, no matter what. Uh, well, I guess with the sloop, he could get that torp off. But it's it's likely he's only in range of one. Because if he does that sloop, what did you say the middle jump's doing? Like Two turn out. left. Yeah, two turn left. Just get out. Barrel roll. Oh, away. yeah, because he's the aged one, so he's getting out. Yeah. yeah. So you're trading shots with one jump. Even if it's torps... Like, you're losing two shields no matter what, so it's not that bad. Yeah. Well, I mean, assuming that you have the focus for defense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, if it's Torps, you save it. Yeah. And if it's the Boba guy, you lose. <laughs> True. But it looked like he used Boba on Miranda earlier. I can't really tell. He has, in, in the list, he has one Boba active, like, like not crossed out, so I'm assuming the one that's hurt is the one that has... In that case, he's never going to get to use it if he's going to run. So that's really good for Ben. Yeah, actually, it's really good that Dash turned right and not left there because if it had been a left turn, then the injured scout is the one that's blocking Dash forever, which is like the absolute last thing he wants. For ben, you know? All because of that one turn there. Looks like we're waiting on the back scout. Because if you're taking one shot per turn, like if you save your focus for defense, it's really not bad. Yeah. Well, the problem is if Dash takes two more shields, then he has to have only half a scout left at time to win, which is hard. True. Yeah, time's really the what he's fighting then. But 43 minutes left if that's the timer. Yeah. Yeah, wow. We've been through a surprising amount of game for... 45 minutes left. I mean, granted, these ships all just hit, like, trucks. Whoa! 
That's not what I expected. He's not afraid. Well, maybe maybe the idea here is I'm going to keep this jump master close enough where if you're going to be able to shoot it, both my other guys who you won't kill yeah. will be able to fire at you. Or maybe he's planning and on blocking you're... it at range one or something too. I don't and know how you By block forcing dash, dash to shoot you because you're low, like you're taking, you're saving health from the other guys, so you're using that. He could also barrel roll towards the bottom of the board. That's true. That might be the right thing to do. Because I assume dash is three bank writing. Yeah, if it clears, which it should. Debate, debate, debate. <laughs> We're really thinking, or like, this is a slow play, Judge. He's he's been looking through my damage deck for Kylo for forty five minutes now. He can't find the crit he wants. Can't read. My damage deck is in Polish. No, we're oh, barrel rolling in. He's he's all in on the block dash, which makes sense. I mean, it's the only way that he doesn't die, basically. Yep. That's not all in on the block dash. That's all in on the the boba. Like he's yeah, saying, sorry. if you don't kill me with your shot, then yeah, I'm gonna I boba you and I win. Yep. And which this... is a cool play because he realizes like. Ben's actually in a great position now, so he has to do something to try to combat that. And getting two torque arcs on dash is a good way to do it. Yeah. But the three bank, uh, if he can barrel to the top of the board, he probably can get out of range of all but one, if not all jumps, which might be better. I'm curious if it would have been better for, I mean, what's done is done, for Khan to have barrel rolled the center jump to the right and have done a three bank with the back one and then have that one be the focus battery just be able to cover a little bit more ground yeah i don't know it's one of those things where jump masters have so many options that it's hard to even know what's right because so yeah, sure the one the one problem uh, i guess you're running into that issue no matter what because if he goes to the barrel like to the right i don't know if that gets out of range of the the Jump on the left. With the three, the three bank would have. Brought... Oh, he gets three. Can he lone wolf the hit? He does. So that scout's dead. Yeah, so no boba. But uh, see, if he would have done um, that three bank, he probably would have had dash in range for the back jump. It's just assuming, of course, that it's out. I think it's out. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Because this is what you don't want. You don't want one jump on dash. Like this is this is playing straight into Ben's hands. Yeah. Uh, does dash have a focus? No. Uh, wait. Yes. He didn't spend it. There's a token up there. I don't know if it's a target lock or. That is a but... target lock. Missile. Torps. Hey, what do you know? Four hits. What are the odds? So two evades. Two evades. So you did have a focus. Yeah. And that's two more shields. Okay. So down to half. So yeah. I mean, there's a lot of time left. Running for time doesn't seem like a viable strategy for the yeah, jumps. I think so. And I think they actually do lose at this point. Um. Yeah, I don't know. it's like, do you chase Dash and like keep the pressure on him? Like, if you have two Torps, I would say yes. If you have one... No, but you also can't like one turn both away and then run away because he gets ray tokens. Get a billion ray tokens. Right. And like all he has to do is kill one more to win. Well, I guess kill one and get one to half. Which is very possible. Yeah, with 35 minutes. I like Ben's odds a lot, which is crazy. Like, if he got caught in that corner, I think he loses. Um, and if. Khan had done a shorter move with that jump at the top. I think he loses still. Yep. And and, and uh, I'm gonna reiterate, if that back jump had come forward, right? If it had if it had come gone faster. The three bank do you think it would have been range? It would have been really close. Yeah, I think, well, I, think I mean, he did he did only a one bank there. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, uh, like, so we all saw the three bank with dash coming from like ten years away, so that jump very easily could have been out of range or dash had to take two torps. Mm -hmm. If you wanted to barrel roll for the shot, which I think was probably the uh, like game deciding moment. Mm -hmm. 
I mean, you know, it's still not over, right? Like, Dash could now be the one that just rolls a bunch of blanks into the Torp Scouts just trashing him, but... Crazier things have happened. Yeah. So we only have one Torp left, it looks like. Uh, that's really bad news. For God. Um, I'm guessing Dash is doing uh, probably a three bank, maybe a straight, but you, I don't think going into the corner really serves him much good. He could either do a three bank or a two hard, but he needs he doesn't have the ability to barrel roll because he's going to need that that focus. But I think the three bank from him gives him the best chance to only be in range of one jump. I think actor's winning strategy here is to sideboard Sunterfell. <laughs> Make his life a lot easier. Uh, the culture of Mizago lets you do that, right? Yeah. Trevor you Mizago. Pitch, pitch the slicers for uh, Suntir. Thanks. <laughs> Trevor, Trevor Betts is asking uh, if anybody's made a Wrath of Khan joke. Uh, we have not. Oh, my, my chat broke at some point. Or is that YouTube chat? Uh, no, that's Twitch chat. For huh. our for our cast, the Gold Squadron one. Yeah, the last message I still see is Darth Nacho. Yeah, me too. Reload. reload. Alright. You got a cheer by Thorwald. Thank do you. you. Do you get cheers? I'm like it. do you have that set up? I do. Nice. Is that like a tip kind of? Yeah. It's it's a uh, like Twitch just finally integrated like people sending donations in because well, the people still use the oh other God. thing too right like yeah there's still twitch alerts and everything oh the one turn no now that guy can't go straight mm. oh, okay wait but you okay he's gonna he's gonna bring that back back jump master in hard he's regretting yeah it's three, he's like, it's three yeah. banks from yeah. this guy and he already has the target lock there so he just focuses here Oh, oh, it's going to be the one bank. Ah. Keep them together. Don't let Dash escape. Yeah, because the three bank, which we expected, is probably only in range of that one jump still. Yeah, it's I close. guess. And he could, he could just barrel and now, out. Yeah, no, you just you just focus here. Trade with the jump. It's fine. Yep. I mean, the, the only way Dash loses this is if he gets like an unlucky crit, I think. Oh, God, that three bank would have been so good because then Dash yeah, has to barrel into the corner and then you win the game. So I really don't understand. That. Dash doing Dash things for. Con, when you, when you find this commentary, is, man. He's three, saving the focus. Three banks, bro. Three banks. Oh, no. He... There's at least three hits. Yeah. Well, he focused. So he took one. He had the focus for defense. Like, do you think the one bank, the idea here is so that he can do it too hard and get in between those two rocks? Like, is that the, the reason why he maybe made that decision? Maybe. I mean, that is a good place to go next turn, to get try to get in front of Dash, because that is a win condition, potentially. But, like, the two turn next turn, you're still not getting in front of Dash, because you can't barrel well from that there. So you, you're hoping to block the turn after that. So it looks like Dash is taking a little bit more damage here. Which means, like, uh, Dash might be able to do something tricky to get out of that situation, too. Oh, wow. Yep, he, yeah, he, he rolled, he had no focus, and he rolled uh, double yeah. double eyeballs. Against the plasma. Huh. Yep. But now we're out of Torps. Yeah, uh, he's got to make sure that he has game. shots with both. Right, and I don't know, my guess is Dash goes to the far right side of the board with another three bank, possibly. And it's going to be really difficult for the middle jump to get like in range of that, because the two hard, it might be in range. But like range three with just a primary is going to be really sad, like if Dash has focus for defense. Man. I wish we could see the, the angle from the backside because I wonder if something like a f 
four forward and barrel rolling to the right would work. But I don't know if that yeah, could, it's that like could. it's so close as to whether or not it would clear or not. Mm-hmm. Talking about the top jump. Yeah. Uh, what? what so this jump yeah the three bank looks like it's on a rock yeah yeah if that four straight works that i am still not sure it blocks the three bank from dash though no that's that's still money though you get in range one and be like that's fine yeah, yeah, that jump, the bottom jump doesn't hurt. have good moves this turn, though. Nope. Yeah, like, I don't think he's going to get better than a range 3 shot. And he has no torps. And Dash could easily shrug that off. But, like, it all comes down to, I mean, kind of comes down to dice at this point. Like, if Dash's defense rolls hold up, um, or if, like, the scouts get a good crit through or something. Well, hello, hello single dice. <laughs> it's beautiful. Something that must have happened to the poor color key. Maybe the dice just hung out in there too long. It looks like the uh, the tray is gray. Maybe picked up on the gray and the marbling. Yeah, I mean, Dash's options are pretty limited because he doesn't have any ray banked up, so he can't afford to really barrel all here. And I don't like the straight to the edge of the board because your hard turn, you're at a weird angle, so your hard turn's not going to get you back on. The one thing Dash could do potentially is hard turn to the top of the board, too, if there's enough room there, but probably not. Yeah, they're chit chatting and pointing at the bottom right hand corner of the board. Can Dash get there this turn? Yes. Oh, sad. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's, oh, that's a ballsy. Rock. Whoa. So that's not how you win. Oh, oh my god, is it? Isn't not... it? Oh. You sure it's not oh, how wow. you win? They just moved it around, so <laughs> now it's clear the rock because everyone's is. moved it so much. I mean it was close. Like that was I don't know if he had to go for that play. But if it cleared then that could have been game because that would have blocked. Oh guys, you know we know what just happened. It's gold squad and stream. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Dion. Thanks, Gold Squad. JK, JK, JK. And they knew they were on this screen. They and now Actor is convinced that it wasn't on the rock, and Ben's convinced it was on the rock, and someone's upset. Yes. That sucks. Because, I mean, the... honestly, like, it comes down to that, right? Because if that clears, you block, and you, like, a no focus dash, it's still not great. Like, leaving the not... template doesn't help, guys. <laughs> it's not where it was. You're Nothing right. matters. Yeah, the the template slid, the rock slid. You need to get the augmented reality thing on the stream to be able to tell where it should have been. Looks like they did a fifty fifty for it. Somebody. Who who hits there? I don't yeah. know. We'll, we'll find <laughs> out. Does he get an action or not? I guess that'll be our answer. I mean, the sad thing is, I don't think that play. Was There's worth lots the of risk hand movement right now. There's lots of hand even if even if he gets the block. You denied him a focus, but you're getting a one range three shot. Maybe maybe a better shot from the other guy. So it didn't doesn't look like it cleared. So that's just game there, I think. Wait, what? Maybe that was roll for damage. The, the back yeah, was roll for damage. Did, did it move? Oh. Forgot to move him, so he just stays there, right? That's how it works, Chris. I don't know. know. I don't know what's <laughs> happening. Or maybe you got PS zero. No, that doesn't make sense either. Because he went between the two jumps. I think they just forgot. I'm confused. So yeah, at this point, it looks really bad for Khan again. Yep. And that's a good HLC shot. Four. Is he taking out four? Two, if that's the healthy one. Okay, so some looks like they rolled a, a crit on the rock, and it was a direct hit. So he's down to, oh, twice gotcha. down to one. That's what I figured because he took a lot of damage. There. So like he went for a big play and it didn't work out because he got the block. It would have been a little better for him, but it's not. 
even though Bach isn't game winning, so I feel like the risk wasn't worth it because that was a game losing play. Like if it didn't work out. So Khan, Khan, I wonder, did you place the template all the way in the left of the slot, and then move the ship and then put it all the way in the left? You get that like little bit, little bit of wiggle. Yeah, that's that's a lot of wiggle at the end of a three bank. Yeah, you, you got to use the. But wiggle. I mean, I wasn't convinced. Everything got knocked, so who knows? You moved it too fast. Not enough wiggle. Wait, what is rolling now? I'm confused. The the jump is attacking. Oh, it didn't die. Okay. Oh, that crit going through. That <laughs> what is happening? Is this is the first control fire? Okay. Yeah, it's yeah. A stress. That's actually like super big. Because yeah, now that the other guy can block. Wow. Yeah. What the hell? He's got him. <laughs> this game is crazy. But I don't know if he wants to block with that one because no, he doesn't. Uh, the other guy has four health. The, four health is enough to take the shot. But I'm saying, so the like, I think further the away one, yeah, you'd, rather, one pull. you'd rather be in range one and, and not block, is what you're saying. Because, yeah, the one health guy is the one on the rock. So he. Oh, he yeah. Might yeah. Not Wait. You sure? Yeah, I that's right. Yeah. Because the other guy took two damage this turn. Yeah. Oh, okay. So block it so yeah yeah it's correct so yeah that guy can now like three bank and dash is very sad because he's either blocked or i mean do you do like a one bank because like dash dash is like his fastest green is like a two straight like he's not going to be able to barrel out of range one of the jump if he doesn't get blocked and then you're taking a range one shot which is even better than blocking i mean the only advantage of blocking is taking away the focus Whereas, well, it's just taking away the focus and uh, the back guy can also be at range one. True. So somebody in the it's... YouTube chat just asked, hey, Chris, if we run a local tournament using your missions, any chance we can get some crate swag for prize support? I do not have any crate promos at the moment. Uh, so eventually that will be true, sure, but I need to print them. <laughs> so Chris. I don't know how long that's going to be. But, well, see, Chris, but is, isn't that problematic though, Chris? Because isn't our goal to get like everybody to play these? So are you really going to send out like hundreds and hundreds of promos and just no? Every, every but time somebody does usually it, usually only a couple people ask. So if I don't say publicly that if people ask me for stuff, I send it, then it's mostly fine. Dash is at one hole apparently. All right, hold on. Sorry. Hold yeah, because you can print second. Yeah. So you you want to get the block and then you do a bank barrel roll with the middle jump to get in range one of the block. It's my turn to make a clip. Do uh -oh. you do, don't please do you don't do quit me saying block? if people message me I'll send them things. That's it. All righty, here we go. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I care about you too much. Like that. That's then, then I will level. actually have to just turn people away. Yeah, that's just extra that. level mean. That hurts your bank account. I ain't about that life. Speaking of being about that life, let's see how this is doing on Reddit. <laughs> You're at nine upvotes, oh, which is pretty good for two in the morning. Yeah, it's not bad. How many hateful comments? None. None. Wait. No, that's one. That's at least Fuck one. Fuck Dion. In quotes. In, Must be quoting something. In quotes. Yeah. Who, who I don't is know. it? Who is it? Call him Death out. Revived? Oh, yeah. Call him yeah. Out. That guy. Yeah, I told you he hates me. Oh, okay. That like, box. I like, that was a joke. Years. That's not a joke. That blocks pretty much all of Dash's moves there. So then I, I like the bank and the barrel for the other guy more than the hard two but the hard two might be good enough oh it's a quote okay. i mean a lot of people say that so i can't hard two is probably fine i can't uh i don't know who <laughs> who are you quoting which person i think i was told that at least two times this week so let me, let me know. oh by the way death revived i, I owe you a beer <laughs> okay i owe you a beer you're quoting me? I said for me to F myself? Probably. I'd believe it. Yeah. So, actor one. Oh, gotcha. In a ridiculous swing of things, actor one, after the silliness. The three bank was the right play. <laughs> it worked, so it was correct. <laughs> I mean, it probably gave him a bit. Well, if he did the straight and barrel, might have also been in a good position there. But maybe he wouldn't have been able to get that block. Yeah, I'm going to look at how much time's left. 20 minutes. 
I'm glad, though they were both like clearly and obviously upset with what happened. I'm glad it didn't like get worse. So we've all seen it get worse. It's not super great. It's super rare, but well, no, sure. it went against Gone and Gone ended up winning. So I think that's the best. I mean, like it's, it's not like it's hard for either person to be that. super upset about it. Right. So I'm looking at standings uh, right now. There's three, four, and no players. Uh, four once this score sheet gets in. Um, Jaren's the top three and one, five ninety one MOV. That's really good. I don't see a lot of other. Where's Papa Foss? One and three. Shame to his family. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys. Well, are, do you guys want to keep going? Like, I, 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 I have to go to I'm, bed. I'm out of yeah. I'm, what I'm little good. valuable insight I had. <laughs> okay, cool. Well, everybody, so it. thank you for uh, for coming out and just hanging out with us. Uh, thank you to Renegade Renegade Squadron Gaming for uh, giving us permission to uh, you know do some do something a little bit different for our intergalactic theater. Um, I guess thank you to uh, who, who do they have in this corner here? Irresistible. Thank you for to Twitch chat for never telling Dion that the vassal dice have been on the stream the entire time. Oh <laughs> really? Come yes. on, guys. Wrecked. Good work, team. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I feel dumb. Great. Got him. Got him so good. That's fine. It's a watermark. It's fine. Yeah. I actually didn't notice until just now. <laughs> uh. <laughs> they're just listening to our sultry voices. I think that's what it comes down to. They're sure. not even they're not even uh not even reading. And dice go away. Great. I want to see what happens with these games, but god, I'm tired. Yeah, it's it's late for sure. Oh, um, speaking of the Renegade Squadron guys, they are doing it this with commentary for day two, like they're on their own stream. So yes. make sure you watch it because for sure uh, they're not America, but there's still some good Australian players. So I'm sure the couple that are good that don't make the cut will have some good insights and stuff to watch. Absolutely. I mean, even though the the fact isn't the new fact isn't legal for this tournament yet, uh, there's always things you can learn from games, whether it be strategy tactics um who knows i mean we we only get to see a small sample size of the list we might see something really interesting if somebody tried to bring something that uh works post fact so uh we'll just have to see and you can watch jump masters go out with a bang it's sure a little everyone's thing. excited for that getting direct hits onto rocks oh i forgot the crates on top when our boy won Nicely done acting. All right. So what is it? What, who is it saying? Yes. Uh... Wait. Whoa. Whoa. Hang on. All right. Everybody in the Twitch chat, I need you to go to Facebook and search for Gold Squadron Podcast and Chicago X-Wing. There's a poll. It says, what fact change do you think will change competitive play the most? <sighs> um, the top vote is not soon to your, probably because you spelled it wrong. But uh, I didn't put it in there. It was whoever Why didn't you? Put it in. It was whoever put it in. I, I, it's an open, it's an open poll because those so, are the best. So please go in there and vote for Sunterfell. We're down thirty votes. There's twenty four of you here. We're almost there already. Please go do God's work. Thank you. I will accept all people into the group. It's fine. <laughs> you can leave afterwards. Will you accept my like blatant catfishing alt? <laughs> Uh, uh, it's a little. It's a little late to tell me the vassal dice are on the screen. Thank you, though, uh, uh, <laughs> Johnny. <laughs> it's a little, little late. Little late. We can uh, put anything on the screen now. Doesn't even matter anymore. Let's see what we'll do here. We'll uh, we'll do the the booth view. Where is that at? Oh, camera's turned off. I. Hello, Chamara. There it is. All right, beautiful people. It's late. Uh, Chris is one hour. God, it's 2 a.m. where you are, dude. It's crazy. What's up? 
this one? Yeah. It's it's badass. You want to wear it? You want to see it? Like see it on? All right, hold on. I can't go to Mandalore because they didn't announce it with enough time. It's coming. I was thinking about getting one for his kid, so we wanted the review. Yeah, it's it's. I don't have the batteries in it yet because I don't want them to leak or anything. Yeah. But uh, nice. yeah, nice. it's nice. I mean, I I have a really big head and it fits. Um. Can you wear that for the entire Twitch stream next time and have yes. your camera? Yes. Uh, what do we stream? Morning. Battlefront. And then you decide. Oh my gosh. Beforehand, you have to play that every time you get poked. That's how it works. It's in the rules. <laughs> Right, I have to like not you eat. Gotta take the speakers out and replace it with uh, your like computer's output, so you can just wear it the entire time and use it as a headset. Do you do you have the skills to do that? Between me and Andrew, I'm sure we can figure it out. Right into this. Oh, here, here's so the the right visor goes up. I've never written a headphone driver, but it can't be that hard, right? It'll be fine. I I can get people. Yeah, I the yeah, vi like, the visor does go up. And so, um, do you think the Kylo one will get me kicked out of a tournament if I play Racklo and then wear the Kylo mask and people will show up on the dark side the entire time? Oh, wait, are you saying the, the hold on. This one? I see. I can wear my glasses with these, and I can see. Does it have a back to the helmet? It does. Alright, I'm waiting for you to turn around because I can't see it. You didn't turn around, I don't know. Whoa, wow. Can you see out of it okay? Like, could you play X-Men with that on? I could. I have. Amazon.com. Okay, so here. I, I, I modded it up a little bit, though. So. How'd you, how'd you mod it? So. There is a there is a really light colored mesh there where you could see my eyes through it. So my wife had this thin uh, black sheet and I just glued it in there. You can't really see it; it's not bright enough. Which one is this? Is this the so there's a bunch on Amazon? Is this the Black Series Kylo Ren voice changer helmet? No. Okay, it sounds amazing though. It's two hundred dollars. I think you need to get a voice modulator. If it doesn't come with it, get it separately. It's And I put some I put some sponges in there so that it stays still. Yeah. Yep. I mean, you can come get just, this one. Just bring Ragbo anyways. Just for Chrissy wears it on it. I mean, that might not be a bad argument. Wow. Alright, I'm going to put this down open. Remind your future Chris. Make poor life decisions. Yep. Yeah, this one's pretty nice. And it's light. That's the other thing. It's really light. Man, this one does not look light. No, the... the no, the the voice changer one is not the one you want. And this one actually it comes in two pieces. If you just in case your head is that big, it's two parts. I mean, my head is full of hot air, but I don't think it's, but this one's all like battle damage. And it's got like the uh, All right. People in Twitch chat, I need to know they want you to paint it uh, pink and then put it on with you around. Oh pink. god. Get one of the stickers for it. Could you imagine? <laughs> No. All right, we need to find what what's going to be our outro song here.
<laughs> yeah, but it's not. This is not a great podcast. This is my podcast. <laughs> it's whatever whatever feels good. I don't know if it should, should I trust you to click links? I don't Uh, I think I'm going to go now that has like German, uh, no, is that Russian symbols on there? We're going to, we're going to go out with the magic soon tier, right? I think that's all right. It, it's playing. No, no, I'm good. I, 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 I sat through there as I was driving. I was like, damn it, damn it, Chris. He's calling you? He hit the wrong button on the chat. <laughs> ah. I think the weirdest thing is that the background has the real uh real words in the background, like really soft. It's kinda strange. I think they can. They say too loud. I think you turn it up. Oh, oh actually, it turned out that that the audio was off. There we go. Wow. Yep. Cause I switched screens. Whole new world, baby. I never knew him. But when I am so, who's the best Disney here, princess? It's crystal Belle. Yeah. Belle is the uh, is the uh, the beast yeah, girl, beauty right? Beast. Wow. Yep. right. Yes. Yes. Got my on the um, that's a boring answer, but I guess it's acceptable. Yep, take it. What about you, Andrew? What you got? I said Leia. No, that doesn't count. I mean, it does right legally? <laughs> no, I'm the Senate. I can oh, tell crap. you. What what is Ah I'm a pretty big Jasmine fan, I guess. I was gonna say Jasmine's pretty pretty strong, pretty strong choice. Bell is another good choice. I was hoping you'd say Mulan so I could call you a weeb. That's all I wanted before <laughs> I was going with this. Actually M- Mulan is pretty pretty badass. Oh you weeb. Weeb. <laughs> I mean, come on, that that song, dude. Like, I'll make a man out of you. Like, no, that's, I'll absolutely that's my jam. have him be the, the best Disney princess. No question. The trainer guy. Are you assuming his gender? Yes. He is a anti dropper. I'll make a man out of you. That's gonna be your next spoof song. Like, know? I get a little moist every time he comes on screen. I'll be a little honest. <laughs> well, let me find here. I'll I'll, I'll share. Cause I guess I didn't. Where's what was that one called? Uh, is it on my desktop? I'm trying to find that audio for that other song that I shared that one time, somewhere. Oh, I have it. Right. Comboing. Oh, that's what it was called. I was like, "What the hell was it called?" Uh, I'm putting it in Skype. Oh, he's like, he's like, I got the file. <laughs> I saved it. <laughs> <laughs> I brought it up when you're talking about it. Easily accessible. All right, this is this is what we'll end with, everybody. Do you want to accept this? Yes, I want to accept. Yeah, do it or no boss. Click Vitas, play it. Let them listen to the beautiful <laughs> mouse noises, mouth noises. iTunes, play, play things. You, iTunes is your default media player. No wonder you have horrible problems all the it's time. Got a, it's on a MacBook, dude. Does he have any other options? You use VLC like a civilized human being. I don't. I don't even. You're speaking a different language, sir. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm sorry. I meant use uh, Windows Media Player like a civilized human being. <laughs> you phony. There it is. He's just All trying right. to appease me. 
All right, making it, Andrew happy. It's, it's gotta playing. Please, our corporate sponsors. Yeah, nothing makes me happier than Windows Media Player. <laughs> Huh. I noticed I'm not your default. Would you like me to be? No, are you sure? <laughs> Wait, it, it comes with your machine? Are you sure? Yeah. I have Movie Maker. When, yeah, when, I have Windows Media Player and like a Windows 10 Enterprise key. Ooh. Enterprise, so fancy. Yeah, it's, it's like we all have MSDN licenses or something. Yeah. That's how it goes. Nice. I'm sorry we're ruining your outro, Dion. That's fine. I'm just jamming. We need to come to peace with it. If not, we'll go insane. We gotta play better, adapt, get good, attack. They all mean the same. Now ask yourself, what do you want on this tournament day? To fly your favorite ships or what? I look forward to it. Now that it randomly works. Say that again? Say that Every person that I play to be the best or fly without a care. Let's put this to rest. What? What's up? Huh? Judge? What were you saying? I was saying, can we just keep saying Gold Squadron out over and over again and eventually be right? Gold Squadron out.